Good evening, party people, or kind of early evening, I suppose. It's around 6 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time, a little earlier than usual, and we're headed to the White Palace today, tonight, this evening, on Hollow Night. I think, I was going to say, last we left off was right here. We were sitting on a bench. It was pretty great. I put my Grim Child away because Grimmery was being a little a little bitch, um, as, as per usual, uh, and I can't have my boys with me because otherwise those little fly things there that kind of... My little jump jump the sisters will not be able to help me out. They all sound a little mechanical, so I'm excited to see where this goes. This is a very, very fortunate area. Fortunate, dreamful area. I see a lot of those, like, dream catchers around, so maybe this is, like, in the realm of somebody's dream or something like that. Um, so we're just going to see what happens as we go forward. We're doing things a little bit earlier this evening because there was a bunch of scheduling, like, craziness and mishaps going on today. Things, things are just different. But uh, all in all, all is well. Things are great in the personal life. I'm still very tired, but my mother is coming to visit tonight. And that's a good enough reason to do things a little earlier. If, you, if your mother is a good person to you. If, you're, if your mother is not a good person to you, or you don't have a mother, then, um, well, anyone will move on from that and try to think about happier things, like dead bugs and something like that. Anyways, this place looks kind of cool. I can, like, I can, like, hit these little lamps and stuff. Oh, not the ones in the background. This is a really pretty location. I can't wait to see what happens here. I mean, I do kind of know what happens here. Um, oh, I can't go up that way, it seems. All right, uh, and the music is beautiful. Oh my God, I just noticed how beautiful it sounds here. Oh, goodness gracious. No, don't, oh. Oh, I'm fine, just sit on the bench. Oh, just sit on the bench, dude. You're fine, you're fine. This is really good music. I think it's Christopher Larkin who does the music for Holiday, and my goodness, what an, what an excellent score. I think, uh, reflecting on when I first started playing this game, I was like, I need to play Hollow Knight because the music is just freaking beautiful. That's that's why I need to play. There's really no other reason aside from just the satisfaction of my ears experiencing that sweet, sweet awesomeness. Oh my goodness. I'm having a lot of trouble. I wanted to see if there was anything up here. If I bounce, and I go up here, and no, nothing at all. All right, I'm just I'm just being a little, a little kooky. Um, maybe I need to go- No! No, 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 no! I did not mean to go down there. That's fine. Okay, that's- that's alright. I didn't need it. Alright, well, uh, maybe I go over on this side and open a gate. Nope, don't see no gate nowhere. I can kind of stand on this little thing here. Yeah, look at that. That's cool. Maybe I can glitch my way in. I've been watching a lot of speedruns recently, uh, specifically of Sonic the Hedgehog games and whatnot. Actually, I watched a Super Mario Galaxy speedrun, watched a Super Mario Sunshine speedrun, Absolutely amazing. The Galaxy speedrun, which I think is the world record, was actually kind of underwhelming because I feel like I saw a lot of like mistakes and stuff like that, which is something I'm just not used to in speedruns. Although, to be perfectly honest, I shouldn't be so perfectionist on that. I'm not a speedrunner myself, and although I like to think that I hold myself to such high standards, I don't think I will ever attain them because of how high those standards actually are. Don't push yourself too hard. But but always, be, you know, some say you're, you are your own biggest critic. So, give me the soul. That is a really cool looking statue. I like that statue. It's creepy, but it's creepy in a cool way. And it kind of looks like a crown. It looks like the king's mold, like the king's mold heads that I saw as I was coming in. Maybe I can just crystal dash, just like that. Oh, hello, oh. Hi there, oh, no, 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 I can't go up that way. Okay, well, I, I certainly tried my best. It was just, it was just something I had to do. Okay, so I can't go up this way yet. It seems like it is lock and I can't break it so that's fine I'll just go down here then hello who's in hi there it's you oh I get to defeat another one of you and then I get some information in my little log so I'm gonna take this form that's great um I think I put all my charms on right yeah and the greed which isn't so fragile so excellent I'm gonna kick your butt how's that yeah how's that oh my goodness you just went for it didn't you well there's all of the energy that I have to do shit like that nope enough of that nope just Full ham, just go, just go right for it. There's just, there's nothing. Anyway, tell me, tell me more. Tell me more, Hunter. In the journal, where are you? Oh, the poor God Tamer from last week. I love that the God Tamer, or the two creatures that make up the God Tamer are just that. Some hunters train beasts to join them in chasing down prey. I tried it once, but couldn't resist the urge to taste my companion's strength against mine. Delicious. Um, where, where are you, King's Mold? Oh, there you is, King's Mold. They say the old king died long ago but his influence echoes around us still. A creature like that, what did he desire? Who knows, probably friendship. All we ever want is friendship. Friendship and to not be alone. That's all I yearn for in this life. Just, just a lack of aloneness. 
which is why I'm here with all of you people. All of the people who make up the ether of the internet. So hello, ether of the internet. I'm still Cameron. That hasn't changed. And I don't anticipate on it changing. But I hope that if it does change one day, that everything will, everybody will, will alchemist with open arms. Everybody. Although that's not necessarily the case. But we'll, we'll try our best. We like to foster a community of happy, fun thinkers and people who, even if they don't think, are still at least pleasantly existing. Um, and if we haven't done that, well, our suggestion bin is always open. Feel free to DM me at, I think it's still just the Twitch handle, on Twitter. Or, uh, or feel free to message me on the Discord. We've got that stuff there too. I have an Instagram, you can message me there. There's a TikTok. I think you can message people on TikTok. So you can do that too, but only if you want to. There's absolutely no pressure to do so. Whoa, okay, I guess I'm not going in there. Um, can I go in there? Oh, I cannot go into the devs. Interesting. I guess I'm just trying to make my way go up. That was English, right? Uh, hmm. Okay, so I lit the light. That was good. Oh, I probably have to go back in the other direction. Back where I was before. Because there was a gate that was locked in the other direction, right? Hey, give me more souls. No, okay, that's fine. Don't fall, don't die. I'll go back the other direction. It's a puzzle palace. That's what it's all about. A puzzle palace. And this is open now, yes? Oh, it is open now, yes. Stand here and do... Oh, oh, look at that. Ah, magical elevator. I like the sound of that. It did make a nice sound, although to be perfectly honest, the sound is not really what was the best feature about it. It was the whole locomotion of it all. That was the best feature. I do like me a nice locomotion. So come on, everybody. Do that. Do the locomotion. Or, or don't. I actually do not know how to conduct myself in the locomotive fashion. I am not a train, nor was I born in the early 80s, might have been when that came out? Maybe like early 90s? Not sure. Not, not very good on my musical history. That's not a class that I took. They actually offered, like, a rock history class back in my high school. I never took it. Yeah. Just didn't have room. Oh, hey. Oh, what are y'all talking about? Are y'all talking about rock history? Yo, yes. do y'all listen to Led Zeppelin or ACDC? Do you? Ah, oh, yes, yes. We do absolutely conduct ourselves in such a fashion when talking of the great rock legends. Indeed. Have you heard of Eddie Van Halen? Oh, my God! Yes, yes, please take our lives. It's what we burn for. Royal retainer, the most loyal, devout servants of the king. Defeat eight more, no, devout servants of the king. Ah, the king of rock and roll. Elvis Presley. That's a, that's a word devoting ourselves to. Yes, bow to the, I am not your king. I am merely an admirer. I must kill eight more of you to learn more. So I'm going to kill one, two, three, four. That's a total of six, right? Right, I need four more. All right. One, two, it's okay. It only hurts a little bit. You're all just figments of my imagination, it seems. Yes. Simple, weak creatures find strength by forming a hive and obeying a ruler. Such creatures become the arms and teeth and claws of their monarch. Well, you are not really, you didn't seem very clawful, you know? You actually seemed very pleasant. And to be perfectly honest, I had no right to snuff whatever life was left of you like that. You did not need to. It was uncalled for, it wasn't necessary, but I did it anyway, and honestly, I'm totally okay with that. I would think that I'd feel guilty about it at some point, um, but you know, therapy starts soon, so we'll talk about it then. Let me inside, please! No? Okay. How about over here? I saw that there was an area to go up, actually. I kind of want to go up there. Hello? Nope, that ain't happening. Nope, can't get a- I don't even have an up dash to be able to bridge that gap. I'll hang here, heal a little bit. Move around, leave some spores behind me. It's just what we do. It's how I cope with my surroundings. I like, I fart out spores. Oh, what does that sound? Aha! Spinning saw blade. Whoa, hi there, spinning saw blades. This reminds me a lot of World of Goo, I think. I think they also had spinning saw blades. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I thought perhaps that you there was gonna, it was gonna hurt me, but it did not. Not in the way that I thought it would. Oh, dear. It's okay, if I stand right here, we're fine. Yes. Oh, dearest me. That didn't work at all. It's dangerous. Oh, Jesus Christ. I did not, I, whoa, blanked out on that one. My mind was elsewhere. It's raining somewhere else, they say. Oh, gee whiz, it goes. I did not do that right. Here comes the saws again. Oh my goodness. I don't even know what's going on here. 
I conduct myself usually pretty well around rotating sharp objects, but this time, I just, I just can't. Hi, hi, no, 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 no. There we go, stand here, carefully. Yes, um, I'm trying to think what the best way to get through that is. Um, I'm thinking just dash, yes, dash. Oh, <laughs> very stressful, very, very stressful. It's okay. Surely there can't be more saw blades. Oh, of course, but that- Whoa! Okay, okay, all right. Not exactly what I had in mind. Oh, no! No, not the saw blades. Why? Why saw blades? Why? Actually, I can hang on the wall with my crystal dash, right? Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I wanted to- uh, Goodness gracious. I should have slid down the wall. If I go up like that and just like- Just like, yeah! Exactly like that! That's exactly what I was hoping to do. Excellent. Okay, just go, just go. Oh my goodness, I did not realize that that was happening. All right, well, at least we got this little checkpoint to here. I'm great at platforms. It's, it's wonderful. I'm so, so good at platforming. I can go up for the maximum time. Oh no. Not in the saw blade again. No, no, oh, I forgot. Ah, oh, jeez. That was a perfect timing though. That was, that was excellent. No, it was perfect timing. Excellent timing, but alas, nope, not this time. All right, go up, dash across, go here, and then up there. Oh, excellent. Let's just, let's just keep this momentum going. Keep, keep the momentum going. I actually got some of my soul back. I forgot. I get some of that when I'm, when I'm hurt. Oh my goodness! Oh, oh, okay. I was not expecting that, but it seems that we made it out the other side. And by the other side, I mean the top of the funnel, assuming that this is indeed a funnel. And I am now under the impression that I'm going to have to go back down that. No, wait, no, no, no. There was a big crack in the ceiling, so maybe if I just don't f fall, everything will be fine. Everything will be fine. Hey. What's up, we're in saw blades? Who's in saw blades? I'm in saw blades. Can I? That looks like a surface that I can stand on, right? It kind of does, but I'm doubting it, but I'm gonna step on it anyway. Okay, nope, they were actually just saw blades. I, I don't know how I missed that, but I did. All right, carefully now. Where to go after? Oh, I go to the side. I understand. Hang on the wall. Hang on the- Whoa! Ah! 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 No, it didn't work. Actually, it kind of did work. Not gonna lie. That worked surprisingly well. I'm gonna go the low way around. Yeah, I like- oh. I- I can't? No, okay, I- I need to go downward, it seems. I need to go downward. Oh, I'm so glad I didn't move to the side, otherwise that would have been terrible. Uh, dash? Okay. Uh, dash. Oh, jump. Yes! Excellent, 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 excellent. I cannot look over there, otherwise- No! Yes! Excellent crystal dash there. I feel like there is also something that... It looks like it's off to the left-hand side. But I don't want to take this chance. Maybe I heal a little bit. And then take the... No, not going to take the chance. Okay, I am trying... Oh. Ooh. No. Oh, you're going to send me back down there? Ugh. Oh. It's fine. Actually, it was pretty easy that time, too. Go up there. Okay, I see spikes on that side, so I'm gonna stay over there. Okay, I see that. So I need to go in when that thing goes up, like here. There we go. Down. Nice. Down. Great. Cross. Bounce a little. Excellent. Ooh. It's finesse. It's also overconfidence. We'll see where that gets me. I need to go up. So when you go down, then I need to go there. Okay. Great. That was pretty good. And now I need to go across? I need to go up. I see. What is the best time? Um, it seems when that goes down. Start an arousing game of how many streams can I have up and not melt my brain or laptop? Hi there, Lorelai. I believe in you, but I also believe in your laptop. I have a, I have a pal of mine who may have a very, uh, a very low running, um, water-cooled power supply. The, I think the fan's not spinning right, and so I, I mourn for that computer. Um, when you go down, I go across. Down, go across. Excellent. Just like that. That was great. I think the best is for when that right one goes down. I'm gonna pop to that little opening there. Pop to the opening. 
That was so good. Now I need to go up and... Is that a surface? It is a surface. Oh, that was great. I'm somehow scared of this surface. How have I been? This week is off to a very interesting start. So my bike broke last week. So I'm going into the shop tomorrow to buy a new bike. They're giving me a discount, which is very, very nice. Um, in addition to that, we've got some new company goals and stuff that are hitting us. So uh, we're off to a great start in terms of that other stuff. Oh my god, don't, please. Oh, great. So uh, we got big projects happening this month, which could be very, very good, could be very challenging, could be a very fun learning experience. That or it's just going to be stressful. We'll see how it goes. I'm meeting up with my mother tonight, so that'll be fun. That'll be a nice, like, break from the hoo-ha of things. Not to say that what goes on on a normal basis isn't, like, a good kind of hoo-ha, but, like, you know, sometimes instead of the hoo-ha, you just need to sit down and have some... Ah. You know what I'm saying? That's what I'm going for. A little bit of that ah -ha, kind of sighing of relief. There is more. There is more spikes to be had. I love the idea that... Assuming this is like the palace of the king, because there have been a lot of mentions of kings and whatnot in this location, that the, how the king chooses to protect himself and the denizens is just a bunch of moving, rotating saw blades. Like, of all the different technologies and stuff that are present in this hallow nest, we chose moving saw blades. An excellent obstacle, mind you, th mind you that. But this is what we chose. Oh, you got hit by the spores. I am so sorry to your friend, but I bow to you. Thank you. There was nothing down there of interest. All right, I see spikes. I'm gonna hang on this wall. Hanging on the wall, bouncing on the wall. Oh, to the side, great. Oh, nice, excellent maneuver there. Gonna go down. Oh, spikes in the middle, excellent. Get myself a little bit. Very, very good. Yeah, Pell King was very thorny on main with all these saws. Oh, very much so. A very thorny, thorny Pell. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, it's good. Yes. Bow to me. I deserve your praise. Watch what happens when I dash. Dash, dash. I dash through your body. Switch. Got him. And uh, I suppose that opens up the next area, right? Oh, this is where I was before with the tall open roof. I'm glad. And that means that I can click this button. Light the way. Where is the way? I know not where the way be. But I hope the way continues to exist as this. Oh, I gotta go through these... Thorny saw blades again. This is the one I had not a have. No. Okay. It's okay. I'm like a change man now. I know exactly how to deal with these things. Just like that. <laughs> change man. Half expected you meet a sharp shadow and kill somebody by accident. No, no, no. No sharp shadow here. Um, I try not to weaponize that. I just feel like I feel like it would be really, really useful. But to be honest, I don't. I don't dash very well. Not not when it comes like I don't know how to skillfully dash yet, and so I don't know whether I should take up my particular space with uh with um abilities such as those. Oh, actually this is going a lot easier this time around. Wow, that was <laughs> that was awesome. Oh, that just kidding. No, that that's that's fine actually. I'll I'll dash. I'll dash, that's what I'll do. There is nothing to be seen in the distance. I'm okay with that. Um, I wonder, was I supposed to go back up this way? I actually, come to think of it, I feel like I sh shouldn't have come back this way. I lit the thing, and when I lit the thing, something happens. I don't, I don't know. I don't know whether I was supposed to come back this way or not. Um, I have a feeling not. I'm gonna look at my map. Do I have a map for this area? No, I don't know where I am. That's fine. That's all right. I have a feeling I wasn't supposed to go back that way. So I'm gonna try to go down. Trying to go down. Trying to, nope, okay. We'll try this again then. Trying to go down. Trying to, here we go. Nice. Do a little bit of heals. I don't remember how to get to this place. Only where a secret wall to the Path of Pain is. Path of Pain? That sounds awesome. Uh, in the most painful way possible. No, oh my goodness. Let me down. This, this thing, in the downward direction, completely different than the upward direction. All right, it's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, that was that was wonderful. That was that was great. Okay, I think I'm actually supposed to go back the other direction. Okay, and I see y'all are gonna come through. Do a little bounce. Do a little bounce. Do a little bounce. Don't touch. Thank you. That was excellent. Do a little heels. Only a tad bit of heels. Great. 
All right, so I hit the switch. I lit up the thing. I don't know why I went that direction. I think I need to go back the other way. Don't know why I thought I had to do that. That in and of itself was kind of a path of pain, so I, I don't know why I continued. Hello, oh, are y'all still alive? I guess you've healed. Oh, that's still not open. Oh, I bet there's something on the other side, right? Oh, bench. Bet. Bench. Love that. Gotta love this. All right. I'm gonna guess there's a number of paths on either side. I think you need the main hub to find the next light. Main hub. Oh, dear. Well, oh, I see a switch up there. How do I unlock this switch? Maybe I gotta go... Nope. Maybe I go over here. Oh, hi there. You are... Exit. No, 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 no. I don't want to go anywhere. I'm already this far in. I, I can't. No, no, no. I haven't gone this way yet. Yes. Haha! -ha! More spikes. Oh my god! Alrighty then. That's that's fine and dandy. Okay, so I'm just gonna let you get really, really close, and then I'm gonna follow you. Oh, excellent. That was exactly what I had him. Whoa! Great. Anything down there? Not of interest to me. I'll like. I'm gonna go on this wall. Utilize that to my advantage. I have no idea where that thing is. Can I look? Here's the chance. Nope, bad chance. Oh, actually, that's that's fine. Oh, no. Hi there. That was just grand. Okay, very, very spiky. Very spiky. And across. Great. Great. That was great. It's no wonder all the civvies stay in the same general areas if these don't turn off for anyone. No, no, no. Not even... Not even the king. I'm the king of the fools, at least. Um, not the king of really anything else, that is. Um, yes, please, bow. bow. Uh, show your... Show your respect. Oh my god, hi. Oh! That was convenient. Wasn't expect. Okay, wasn't expecting that either. Can I... I'll take the... Oh, goodness, that didn't help at all. Oh, and I'm all the way back up there. I am a king. I'm a king. I'm the king of fools. I'm the king of fools. That, that's, that's me. You have the official King's Crest and everything. Oh, oh, yes, you're right. Oh, haha. -ha. Marks the bearer as king. Oh, how long this ancient places shall open before it? Aha, I am the king. I've been branded as the king. So, yes, you're right. You're right, I am the king. Bow before your king. You know what? Kings deserve crowns. Screw it. If I'm the king, I'll put on my crown. I'm the king. I'm the king. King must wear his crown. I'm the king of Hellenist. And this is a feat to be celebrated. I'm gonna try to slip through the cracks. That was so great, but why did I do this? Bouncing them to the side. Great. Absolutely excellent. All shall kneel before the king, except for the saws. The saws do not. That's fine. I'm okay with that. I am going to jump. Thir Ooh. Jump. Throat dash. Great. Great. Jump up and then that Nope, can't do that. Um, how about this dash bounce? Thing? Yes. Maneuvering is at its... What is this? No. <laughs> that was great. Dash and then back. Then we jump. <laughs> that was great. That was so, so excellent. No. Whoa. He did it again. They went the blades. Blades and the saws. All right. Let's think about my moves first before continuing. You're gonna go back that way, and you're gonna go across. I'm gonna jump, then I'm gonna jump. Oh, see, that was not the best way to go with. <laughs> what is this? Baby sanded. Baby sanded? Oh, I'm sand- getting sanded on a sanding machine. This is what it feels like, at least. Hey- oh, no, 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 no. Bad. No, stop! Ugh! Saw- bow before your king, you silly saw blades! What is this? No, stop, don't- ah, oh, geez. That was nerve-wracking. All right, just a little jump. Just a tiny jump. Tiny, tiny jump. There, go across. <gasps> no, no. Oh, I guess that actually kind of worked out. Oh, I could have just done that from the very beginning. Great. Excellent. What's over here? I don't... Heels. Like that. You were, you were expecting me to fall, weren't you? <laughs> You're right. Go up and around in this direction. Any more, any more blades? Oh, I just gotta go onto the wall and zoom, but not too far, or else there might be something else spooky hiding beyond. Continue. I lived at least. I did. I did. You expected me to fail, but nothing. 
It's all good. It's great. It's wonderful. Delightful. All right, nice. Okie dokie. Oh, uh, hello. What's this? Okay. And they just go back like that. So I just need to keep moving upwards, right? I just need to keep moving upwards. That was so easy. It's a big one time. I hope that I like pogos. Well, as you know, since my last battle in the Colosseum of Fools, I'm a master of aerial combat. Oh, goodness. What is this? Uh, down there. Oh, this is excellent. I'm okay with this. Oh, <laughs> Oh, jeez. This is fine. And then cross. Oh, goodness gracious. That's fine. Nope, it's fine. Saw, down. Move, there. Hmm? Move, there. Damn it! There. Move, great. There. Move, great. There. Move, great. Dang it! Let's try it again. Move, great. There. Move, great. There. Move, great. Great. Excellent. Now what do I do? I think I should move, move, jump, down. Maybe when it's up. Down. There we go. Yeah. Huh? 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 Oh no! I tried. Dangerous reminder, pogos can turn walls of spikes into risky ladders. What? Risky ladders. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like the sound of that. I don't necessarily feel like I know what the full meaning of that statement was, but I have an inkling of- Dang it! I have a vague idea, and I'm not looking forward to it. This is very much painful. This is a whole painful experience here. I'm going for it. Damn it. I did not. I did not succeed. It's very sad. It's a good thing I got on my soul, right? Let's see how long that lasts for it. Oh, man. Maybe I should just dash, right? Maybe if I have the perfect dash speed. Dash? No. Okay, don't dash. Dashing is too much. Go for it. And go for it. Great. And go for it. Great. And let's go up here. Oh my goodness gracious, I was so close. I'm living in the pain. This is fine. <laughs> it's all pain. <laughs> Dang it. All white and all pain all the time. No, that, that doesn't seem right. No, don't like that. Ah, uh, moving forward. Carefully, bounce. Oh my god. That was pretty good that one time, I gotta say. We've been getting close, closer and closer every time. That's been like the theme of this game for like the past few episodes or something. You know, it's just like we think. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh, that was good. Uh, can you pogo on buzz saws? I don't know, and I feel like I want to try, but not here. Okay, move a little bit, move a little bit. Oh my goodness gracious. No! Oh my god! <laughs> Uh, I feel like my heart skipped a beat there. Oh my god. Oh, what is this? Oh, that's a tiny little. Oh. Uh, I don't like this position. I don't like this position. Cancel. How do I cancel? No, I did not like that position. It was a bad position. Oh my goodness gracious. I am running low on heels. Is is. Alright, let's just like. I can just like hang on the wall until I'm. Yes, the optimal position. That was wonderful. That was so good. Um, do I dare going down there? I will try. I'm gonna dare going down there. See what I can find. What is down here? I don't know if I want to be down here. Do I want to be down here? I don't know if I... Oh, what is this? Oh, oh, okay. I don't know if I was supposed to do that or not. Anyway, I totally did that. Great, let's move on. Am I in the right... Oh, no. No, okay, maybe I was in the right location. I... Don't know whether or not that was a shortcut, but I'm just gonna keep on moving. Hey. Hey. Oh, it totally wasn't. I think that was a shortcut. Hey. All right. Oh, maybe there was something else up there, actually. Um. Oh, yeah, it is. That was cool. Shortcut. Love that. Um, do I dare go down there? I don't know. I feel like. I don't want to, like, inadvertently miss something. Do y'all give me soul? Oh, yeah, I'm gonna take that. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, you are all living soul, and I'm gonna- I'm gonna take that. Thank you. I'm gonna- I feel like there was something I missed up there. I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna go for it, right? No, this- it's- I literally can't. There's no way to, right? I can't go up. I can't go backwards, can I? No. 
This is not gonna work. I don't know why I even thought I could do that. Nope, that's fine. There shouldn't be anything to pick up except for the thing at the end. Great. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take your word for it. I don't feel like experiencing that whole thing again. No, no, that's fine. That's fine. I'll, I'll move on. That was a nice light. That was a, that was a challenging one. I like that one. That was good. Oh, and hit the switch, and the door opens. Yeah. Open for me. Yeah. <laughs> yes, yes. Hi, everybody. Oh, the doors are still... Nope, they're open. Locomotion! Thank you, world. Appreciate that. Can I poke on spikes? Can poke on spikes. Love that. Oh, what is... No, that's fine. Let's continue on. Up we go. There we go. Up to the up direction. There are lore things to find if you know where to look, and I do not. But I can't remember if even the Path of Pain gives you something. Did you say Path of Pain? And I hope I run into it. Nope, that didn't work. Go left! Go left! Go left! Oh my... Alright, that was coincidental, because I just decided out of pure just serendipity to hit that wall. And right as I decided to hit the wall, I saw that message come in. Wow. Speak of the devil. It literally says Path of Pain. Pain! Bring me the pain. What does this do? Inspect. To witness secret sealed. One must endure the harshest punishment. All right, cool. What's the harshest punishment? It's the Path of Pain. Where's the Path of Pain? Do I just go forward? Here we go. Oh, Jesus Christ. Path of Punishment. Nice. Um, hi. Do I hit you? Yeah, I'll keep going. Oh, is that just... Is this Infasol? <laughs> it's Infinite Soul. All right. You go up. I gotta go up? I gotta go up. I gotta go up. I gotta go up. I gotta go... Oh! Gotta go up. I see. Gotta go up. Oh, is this just... Oh my god, I saw. Okay. Infasol indeed, and this is optional. Well, I'm certainly gonna give it my best try, even if it is optional. Path of Pain? Can't do something like that and expect me not to at least give it a try like 50 or so times. Okay, so I see there's a saw up there. Oh no. P.O.P. can take folks like over five out. My god. This might be one of those things that, oh, depending on how we go, I'm gonna write this down on my little map thing here. First try, we don't talk about speedrunners. Oh, no, no, no. I was I was watching some speedruns of stuff earlier. Excellent things. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna mark on my little map, the map that we got going here, that there is a path of pain here. And I'm gonna keep track of all the things that if we go back to Hollow Knight, of the things that we've missed. Cause like, it'd be really, really dope to go back and do more things. Like, we'll see, we'll see what winds up happening. Cause I know essentially Silk Song will come out. And maybe if we have a, a date for when Silk Song on PC will come out, we'll kind of, in celebration, go back and do all the things that we missed in Hollow Knight. No, stop. Ah, uh, da 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 da. Lorelei's saying something. First try, uh, had to leave my Switch a few times when I tried it. Oh man, the, the frustration. Frustration is a killer. No, I tried. Oh my god, it didn't work. Are there any, like, shortcuts up there? Or is it just, like, it's all the way from the beginning? Because I have a feeling. Also, I just noticed, like, this is a very, very interesting... A lovely soundtrack. It certainly feels like this soundtrack prepares you for the pain that is about to unleash. Alright, well, we'll try that. I'll definitely see at least how far I can get. And then, with absolutely no knowledge of how far it is supposed to get. Damn it! There will be places to land, it's not all ups. That's- that's at least nice to know. I like that. No, stop. It's tough to do all those, like, bounces and stuff. Oh my god, I have to, like, I have to stay on that wall a little bit longer. That's what I need to do. I need to stay on that wall a little bit longer. Um, I could use some soul. I could use some soul. Let me get some more soul. I'll take some more of that. Oh, more, 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 more. More soul for your boy who has yet to get past the first segment. It's okay. It'll be great. Get a little up over there. I wait for the thing to come down. That was good. That was good. That was that was potentially not as good. Oh, this is fine. Okay, that was that was pretty good so far. Oh no 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 no! Oh. <laughs> 
That felt pretty good, though. Feeling confident now, all of a sudden. No, please. Oh. Oh, goodness gracious. This is... This is kind of tough. I was honestly thinking to myself, I was like, I don't exactly know what the White Palace has all to it, but I was like, is it... Am I going to be able to make a whole stream of it? No, stop! Ah! The answer is yes. <laughs> it seems so. Oh. That's fine. That's okay. There's the pain. I feel the pain. I can feel the pain. The, fa the pain is actually not on the path itself. The pain is in my thumb. Because I'm a very... I'm a very, like, hard gripper. I, dang it. There's a very, very hard gripper on my controller. Alright. Um, do we heal? Yeah, we heal. I think we heal before moving on. Don't know. Don't know how far those go. Don't know how far the road goes. But I yearn to see at least what the quarter way mark is. That's what I that's what I yearn for. Path of pain. Oh my god, hi. I forgot about that for a moment. The king forgets sometimes. That's okay. The king is often blindsided by enemy attempts to thwart his regime. Oh dear. Maybe I can just do this, right? I wait. I wait until the thing comes down and then goes up. Nope, I don't pff, don't even know why I did that. Nah, that's fine. We'll we'll heal. We'll heal. Dang. I guess we'll get a I guess I'll give myself a time limit on how long I plan on spending on this guard. I have to, or else I might just this just might be the thing that we do. I'm wondering if like Honestly, I was thinking like I hope it's not going to be too difficult to get back to if I want to go back to it later. And to be perfectly honest, it really wasn't that difficult to get to this, like, main hub here. So, I think it'll be fine. Wait for the thing. Nope. Okay. That was fine. Nope. I did my double jump too early. Bounce. Great. Excellent. And then we pogo. No. Okay, that's fine. Pogo. Great. Great. We just kind of do this for a little bit. And get my grip. Do that thing. Do that thing. Do that. Do. Oh, no. Oh, that was pain. That's fine. I at least want to see what gets past that segment there. I want to. I really do. No, stop. I, I understand that I have to witness the pain. I understand that. Goodness gracious. Come on. Off the wall. Vans. Off the. Off the thorn walls. Vans. Vans off the thorn walls. Those are the kind of shoes I'm into. Sneakers. Whoa, ho, ho, did not, did, was not expecting that. No, it's fine. That's, that's what I'm actually doing here. I'm, I'm training, I'm training for my wall climbing. I, uh, I'm gonna do rock climbing eventually. I believe they call it bouldering. That's something that I plan on doing within the next month. If my university decides to give me my alumni card, which I've applied for three times now, <laughs> they haven't gotten back to me. It's, it's really weird. It's like an online form, and there's one form for like physical copies, and I kind of want a physical copy, but I mostly want my digital copy, and I just haven't... They've been ghosting me. Oh, I can only do that once! Ah, uh, okay, I, I now understand that. I don't think I actually realized that before, that you can only hit those things once. So like, I have to, I have to plan that in advance. Like most reservations, at least nowadays, in the, in the mid to post-COVID times. You gotta plan your reservations. If those places are even taking reservations, with op which oftentimes they are not. Oh my god, hold on. I, I got a, I got a nose itch coming on. Alright, continue. You got this, game. Got this. Got this. Just keep on doing your bouncing. This is giving me a lot of... Uh, Celeste vibes. That's what it's giving me. All this wall jumping and stuff? Yeah, it's very Celesty. That's what it is. Celesty is a beautiful, beautiful game. With music by... Oh my god, I can't remember their name. Huh. Well, they got great music. So does Christopher Larkin. You got this. You got this, knight. You got this. I believe in you. I believe in... I believe. Bam. Blap. Blam. Great. Excellent. Plan these jumps out. Blam. Great. Blam. Great. No! Ah! Ah! No! Okay. Yeah, almost missed the post-jump color change here. Post-jump color change. 
Is there a color change? Did I miss that? Oh, well, I definitely would have missed it too. Oh, wouldn't it be cool if the white palace kind of splits into like a bunch of different colors, kind of like a prism? That'd be awesome. From Celeste. Oh, I see. Oh, is in like missing the, the color change as you jump. I got gotcha. you. I got gotcha. you. Ah, yeah. Game had such character to it. Oh, you blasted me to the wall. It would have been helpful. Yeah, I feel like I'm not consciously forgetting whether I'm on my double jump or not. It's definitely unconsciously, but to be able to have like the visual indicator would probably be pretty helpful. I think what I'll do is I'll try... Well, depending on how far we get with this, maybe I'll try for like another 15-ish minutes. We'll see how far we get there. If we're making good strides, then there's no sense in turning back. Um, but if I struggle to get past even the beginning part uh, in, in this next 15 minutes, then we're going to... Let's say that the Nightmare King Grim will be uh, the most effort that we'll have to put in this game, at least for now, until we come back asking for more pain. And there are a multitude of games that I have yet to go back to because I'm just, like, not ready for the pain yet. Celeste is one of them. I'm not ready for the pain yet. So I, I refuse to go back to Celeste just yet until I'm ready for the pain. So, Hollow Knight be might become another one of those games where it's like I will not be going back until I feel like I'm in a position where my body, mind, and soul is ready for the, uh, the, the just absolute trials and tribulations that must happen to call yourself... Oh my god, why did I... I don't know why I did that. I was rambling. That's what I was doing. That's what happens when I ramble. Sometimes the ramblings are good, and sometimes the ramblings are bad. It really really depends on what kind of state of mind we catch ourselves in and what kind of activity we're doing. Most of the streaming stuff is rambling anyway, so... It's actually kind of par for the course. At least that is for me. Not every not every streamer does the whole rambling, chatty style, but that's... that's me. Oh my god, I should've jumped! Jump! Oh my god! Wall! Wall! Plan my next move. Plan my next move carefully. I see a saw. What is... Oh, I see. I see. I see. I see. Okay, I see. I see this. I see this. I don't know what comes next. I don't know what comes next. Can I poke on these saws? Is this the time to find out? This may be the time to find out. Okay, I can. This is great. Oh, no! Oh! Darn it! That was so good! It was so good! That's fun. Alright, so we've answered the age-old question. Can you pogo on buzzsaw blades? Maybe in real life, no. But in Hollow Knight, yes. And by the way, I wouldn't recommend to anybody to try and, whether using a pogo stick or a small blade that is referred to as a nail, to try to pogo stick off of spinning saw blades. It just, it just doesn't seem safe. Now, if you're a seasoned professional, then perhaps. If you are the king of a long-lost kingdom that is dying because of an infection, or perhaps coming back to life because of the actions of the main character, maybe you can give it a try. But unless you find yourself in this particular specific circumstance, I wouldn't recommend it. Oh, no. That was good. And at least we're learning. It's all about learning about your inner self. It's about learning about who you are. It's about learning who the people who went along for the journey are as well. Maybe, maybe it's all about the friends that we made along the way. Oh, dear. Oh! I would say I think throughout this whole streaming journey, I've become more and more at peace with who I am as a person. Dare I say, the friend I made along the way was my soul. And of course, all the other people who are following and subbing and all that stuff. Y'all are great people. I mean, actually, to be perfectly honest, I don't know who you are, and you may well only not be good people, but that's okay. I, like, stuttered for a moment there because I felt my handkerchief on my arm, and I thought it was a bug. So... That last death was my handkerchief's fault. Screw you, handkerchief. You're blue and you're plaid, and you helped me scratch my nose, but other than that, you are a hose. Like an actual gardening hose. Damn it. Befriend the shade run. Befriending the shade. I am at peace with my inner self, including the self that exists beyond me after I fade away. You got it. Yeah, nice saw blade action. Nice saw blade action. Okay, excellent saw blade action there. A little odd with the jumps, but it's it's fine. No, it was not fine actually. It was not fine at all. 
He did in fact realize that it was not fine at all. So said Stanley. Anybody out there ever played Stanley Parable? That whole like narrating the game as you play it was awesome. That was the whole splendor of it. I think they came out with a deluxe edition of that recently. I remember seeing that. I don't know. That experience, I choose to let remain um, in the portion of my memory sought, the, the portion of my memory that exists somewhere around high school and middle school. I'm cool with it staying there. Those are some good times. That and like Goat Simulator. Both games give me very similar vibes. No. Yes, they saw that the it had an uptick again, but it wasn't too into it. Nah, I get that. I feel like the splendor of that game was experiencing it for the first time and maybe a couple times afterwards, but and like but like other than that, I was like, eh, I'm done with this. For the Stanley parable, I mean. I still have at least 10 minutes that I want to try continuing on this thing to see how far the path of pain goes. I believe. I believe. I don't believe in the success, but I believe in at least trying. Besides, the more wind up, the more practice that we wind up having anyway, probably prepares us for whatever comes next, which is the, damn it. Salubra's blessing, Nightmare King Grim, and then the final boss. We're nearing the close of Hollow Knight. I'm like on the on the one hand, I'm looking forward to it, but on the other hand, like, I'm really gonna miss this one. Not to say that it has to go behind us forever. Nope! <laughs> I whacked the wrong side of that, like, electric beetle thing. Darn it. Oh, you know what? I'm now starting to realize that that friendly reminder about, like, thorn walls becoming, like, like, edgy staircases because of those little boppy things. These thorn walls are becoming very edgy staircases. Very dangerous edgy staircases. Like, absolute edgelords. Ah, okay. Go along the wall. It's great. It's wonderful. Avoid the saw at all costs. Bounce. Get it. Hit it. Yeah, all right. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, bounce through. Great, great. That was wonderful. That was that was actually excellent. Good job there. Good job there, guy. Guy. Girl. I, I, I don't know who you are. It's Is it a manifestation of myself? You're a dude. Because I'm a dude. Damn it, dude. Come on. Not thorns. Specifically spikes. Oh, specifically spikes. Uh, okay, not the thorns. Spikes are... Now I recall. It was something along the lines of, like, electrical, like, spines or something like that. I don't really like the sound of that. I don't. Oh, well. We're gonna try it anyways. We're going for it. We're going for it. Man. This real music really does give me that, like, I am suffering vibe. I don't think this was the music that existed in the rest of the cat um, in the palace. This is, like... This feels like specifically a path of pain thing. Goodness gracious. This, I, I genuinely think that this is probably too much for me. Technically, technically speaking, we are on a time limit tonight. It's not really a time limit per se, just kind of a time crunch. That's why we had to start things a little early around here. It's all good, life happens sometimes. And I'd say we have bigger fish to fr- Dang it! But we don't. There are no fish to fry. There are no fish to cuddle. There are no fish to angler. None of it. Nope. Oh, dear. Ooh, come on now. You got it. I believe in you. I, be I believe in you. I believed. And I'm very glad that I did believe in you. Yes, absolutely. That was a... Mm, I was going to say that was pretty damn close, but you know, it was so close that we killed ourselves. Spike walls can be risky ladders because you can use pogos to climb them vertically, but the spikes will still hurt if you fumble. Oh. I feel like this is a tactic that I eventually have to learn to get past the path of, the path of pain. Get past the path of... Get past the path of pain. Getting past the path of pain. Getting past the path of pain. Say that ten times fast. Getting past the path of pain. Damn. Getting into the path of pain. Forget Gee whiz guy. Come on. The wall. Dude. Buddy. The wall. The wall. I just I just gave up on that one. I, I just had to give up. 
This suffering was brought to you by the letter P. The P. The P stands for pain. At first I was like, what does P stand for? Oh no, it's a very obvious answer of what P stands for. It's very much the pain. Oh my god. Actually, I was lying to you. The P stands for Palopite. That's what it stands for. I'm the one who puts the P in Hollow Knight. You know, follow fight. You know? Whoa, it's like one of those, like, like P H's. I believe. I believe. I believe. I believe. I believe. I believed. And look where that got me. P it does not stand for believe. P stands for pain. That's that's what we said. P stands for pain. Da -da. Today, on this week's episode of P stands for pain. That was an excellent maneuver there. Nice job there, Cameron. Good job. Overconfidence. It's a killer. Overconfidence is a killer. All right. Today on this week's episode of The Path of Pain, um, pain. Let's dis let's discuss multiple different types of pain. We've got mental pain. Some would say anguish. Headaches can cause this. Mental trauma, brain trauma can cause this. Mental trauma can also cause this sort of mental pain in the sense that you don't feel anything physically. Now I'm re now realizing that I said headache, which is more of a physical pain, but I suppose you can have a mental headache. There's nothing, nothing stopping that, I guess. It's more like a headache of the brain. No, a headache of the mind, a headache of the soul. You could have, you could experience physical pain. That's the, that's like the most obvious pain. Oh, dang it. That's the physical pain that I just went through right there. My finger it hurts. This thumb specifically. Painful thumb. I'm going to do this up until I have to refill my soul. And then I'm refilling my soul and I am moving on. Unless I get farther than I did previously. In which case, I will continue trying. It's a simple, logical loop. In times of trial and anguish, I like to keep myself, like, in a logical state of mind, attempting to identify all of the feelings that I feel at any particular time. Because if I don't, then I will surely regress back to my primal state where it is all emotion, all the time, all screaming. Not necessarily all screaming, but this perpetual state of, I need to get something out of me. How do I do that? Externalization. It's a way that people cope with their- oh dear with your things you at least know it's here i do i do very fair there are also i feel like this is also an important lesson tolerance you know if you realize that you are going up against things you are getting frustrated my mother always taught me that when you get frustrated with the game you put the game down now i think i've matured a bit since then i wouldn't say that i have in any professional regard gotten frustrated at a game at least not recently but I find that instead of putting the game down, instead, I just kind of keep my mouth running. Instead of externalizing in the way that I used to when I was younger, I instead just kind of keep my mouth running. Which, to be perfectly honest, is helping out quite well right now. Completely unbeknownst to what I thought was going to happen. Alright, great. This is, this is excellent. Oh, exactly where I was before. That was good, though. That was excellent. Could talk more often. What were we talking about? We were talking about pain. Let's keep talking about pain, I suppose. We're kind of on the topic of it, as it seems. Path of pain, you know, pain in Hollow Knight, pain in my fingertips, pain in my brain. Insane in the membrane? No, just pain. Not insane. Not doing the same thing over and over again, expecting things to change. Although, some would say that's exactly what we're doing here. But I don't expect things to change. You see, you go into this without expectations. If you do well, you say, all right, nice. We did well. But it doesn't, we don't expect it to be that way. We don't. I now just realize that I don't think I necessarily need to bounce on those guys to get through that other part there. It looks like, if I recall, there was a little location that I could almost blast through if I time it just right. I don't know if I should try that or not. Maybe I do. Bounce. 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 And it might actually be an easier way through. We'll see. We'll take a look. Oh, it does look like there was a thing there, but I didn't look at it. Getting over it with Cameron with an X. That's me. And I'm getting over it, slowly but surely. I actually, I haven't need to go back to the infinite soul thing for a while because I keep bouncing on those things enough that I actually recover just fine. So, this is fine. I would love to play the getting over it game. Just to try to see if I can, like, actually hold myself to a position where I'm not going to, like, throw my computer across the room. 
or, or my controller or really any part of the setup to be perfectly honest I, I i would not be very cool with that although if i throw my headphones across the room i might be okay with that because i, I have i have some choice words about the corsair headphones that i'm using I had the black ones previously, and then I got these ones, and honestly, I don't think they're as good as the black ones. But the black ones don't hold the charge the same way they did. How did that not work? I cannot even believe that. Focusing. These Corsair headphones, which are the white ones, I don't know if they have a different model number or anything, like to like talk to you when you um, turn the microphone on and off, which like I'm sure is a part of the design which is fine and dandy and all, but I didn't like it. You can actually turn that off, but you have to install software in order to turn it off. And it also has like adjustable RGB lights, which is really cool. But for some reason, the RGB lights don't necessarily work all the time. Like, I don't know what color these things are right now and I'll check after my next pain ex experience. Oh, what color is this? Oh, they're the actual, they're blue and, they're blue and blue, just like they were supposed to be. Well, when I turned on these headphones, they were a weird green color with some grays in there, maybe? It was not what I wanted it to be. And sometimes the synchronicity gets out of whack. I think actually what was happening was I previously had multiple profiles on this computer, like Windows profiles, and I had it different settings on each of them. And so I think what might have happened is like upon startup, both profiles would load. And then after the profiles would load, they would kind of fight over what color scheme they would apply to the headphones, which was kind of annoying uh, but we we got over it we, we fixed it i eventually fixed it lorelei gets me yes you do jabra earbuds needed a phone app to replace the lady's voice on what features are on and low battery into bleeps instead which is kind of annoying actually oddly enough so all that stuff probably happens over bluetooth and the only reason i know this is this is a part of the work that i do with uh, the startup company that i'm at Oftentimes, what we try to do is we kind of try to look and see what the app does and see whether or not we can do that over Bluetooth. And oftentimes, it's a Bluetooth thing. So, there's possible. it's very possible if we could figure out exactly what Bluetooth commands are being sent between the app and the phone, then we could probably make our own little thing to do it for us. Um, but it requires effort, requires a bit of investigation, and some, uh, I'll call them like, reconnaissance techniques that are not necessarily legally legal depending on the privacy policy of the app in question and uh if i don't know what jobra's policies are but i feel like corsair would probably go after me not to say that they should corsair you have absolutely no reason to worry oh my god this is great oh my god look at that oh we made it farther that was great Oh, well now I can't stop. Unless it make, unless it sends me all the way back to the beginning. If it sends me all the way back to the beginning, then no. No, I don't like that. Cam and coarse hairs, crosshairs. We landed. Bars. I love that. Bars is a thing that we say for things that sound really awesome. That sounded really awesome, so that was good. Oh, what am I to do? I think I have to blast through the wall, right? Okay, that didn't work the way that I wanted it to. Oh, I didn't want it. I didn't want it. I didn't want it. I didn't do it right. I didn't do it right. How do I cancel? I want to cancel. I want to cancel. I could not cancel. It's fine, actually. I guess. That, that's fine. I suppose if I need to can it, it's fine. I just come back here and I just refill myself up. It's fine. Oh, we're not going to make it. Not going to make it. It has to be perfect. It was not perfect. Oh. No, it's not going to work either. It has to be perfect. It's got to be perfect. <laughs> this is the pain. <laughs> it's all the preciseness now. Oh, JoJo continued music at this misplacement. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my goodness. I, when, when, you said the jo when you said JoJo, my mind immediately went to, uh, either intentionally or not, went to JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, and I just couldn't think of what. I had to think of like... <laughs> oh my god, it's it! Oh my god, that was great! That was... Oh. Well, we did it once. We thread the needle. <laughs> Oh my god, we landed again. That was actually not that bad, honestly. That was great. Intended the moments before disaster style meme. Oh, the whole like to be continued. It was like Wow. What an, what an insane sense of accomplishment. Oh, the music actually just got better. 
Now, terrible news. If you do want to give up at any point, how do we get back? Oh! Die? I suppose we have to die, is my guess. Oh. That would be my supposite. Damn it. I don't know if I'll survive this one. Oh my god, I was so close! Oh my god, I made it! Oh, excellent! How long does this whole path of pain thing go? Because I think we can do it. Oh my god, don't hit the chair. Or my glass. Hydrate. I hear saws. I can hear saws in the distance. Oh, you're having fun, I see. As you know, Ridoni, we take as many opportunities to have this so-called fun as we can around here. This is one of those occasions. I was not expecting this to occur, to be perfectly honest. I was not mentally prepared for this, but I kind of warmed up to it, so it's fine. I think we're doing just fine. Oh, can't go through there. All right, but I can break that light on the other side because I have the power. Oh, hi there. Hmm. Hmm. I'm going to have to do some pogoing around here. Dash. Oh my god, it was so close! That was excellent. Wow. Beginner's luck, if I do say so myself. Or maybe we're just that skilled at Hollow Knight now. Nope, no, definitely just beginner's luck. All right, glad that we knocked that out of the way. Ah, ah, da, 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 da. Oh, great, move on. Oh, it gets worse. Oh, I don't like that. All right, so if we pogo it. You've got to pogo it there, let it go, dash across, go up and then around, then pogo it again, let it cross again. Yeah, that all made sense, right? Well, I hope you got all that. Now let's see it in action. That was an excellent way of exhibiting how we're not supposed to do it the way that I just explained it. So we're going to try it however many times it takes. Come back now. Come on, you got it. Nope, that, that didn't work that way either. Let's let's heal. Shall we heal? We can heal. We can heal. We'll, we'll try it again. Multiple times. We will Actually, I, I say we'll try again. We'll just continue trying. We just do. We just will. Actually, kind of think of it. I can bounce on the thorns too. No, I can't. Can I bounce on the thorns? I'll try this one more time. No, you cannot bounce on the thorns. <laughs> I love how I had to confirm that for myself twice. That was great. All right, well... Oh, no, we cannot. No, we can't. We've discovered this. Uh, <laughs> bounce. Oh, my goodness. Nope. Spikes, yes. Thorns, no. Well, you know, we try. We try our best. It's around here. Oh, my goodness. Buzz saws are good, though. Yeah, yeah. Very good buzz saws. Oh, why did I do that? I don't know why I did. I don't know why I did this. I don't know what I've been doing. I don't know why I keep doing that. It's just it's in my brain. Maybe I can just, like, dash across. Maybe I just, like... Okay, nope. I'm gonna try that again. I feel like this... Nope, okay. Maybe just, like, down crap. Oh, I like that tactic! Ooh, it was so close! My goodness! It was so... It was, like, this close. I love that tactic. Don't fool yourself. Don't feel like you need to bounce on the buzz saws. You don't necessarily have to in every single area. Oh my god, look at that. Oh god, look at that. Bouncing on the bus sauce. No. Well, we're, we're trying. Great. Excellent. No. Oh, maybe I do have to bounce at least one. Well... No, so if I get over there and I go down, I dash and then bounce. Not bounce. I mean, double. Do the monarch thing. Flap my wings and fly. Is what I was trying to say there. This is all right. This is fine. Get him. Oh, don't. Get him. No. I have to bounce sooner. Great. Oh, it, it was so very, very close that time. It was. Can I bounce with this buzzsaw and get heals? Nope. Okay. I thought maybe. Hmm. I'm running a little low on this thing called confidence. It's not health. It's confidence. Oh, that was great. That was great. Now, what could possibly happen next? Oh, hi. Oh, hi there. All right. It gets worse. That's great. That's great. And, okay, I can land at least. That's good. That's fine. That's good. Nope, we get it from the wings molds. Oh, but of course, but of course we got it from the wings molds. Okay, um... 
Hmm. I'm gonna have to bounce on those spikes. Bounce, bounce, very light bounces. No, it was a light bounce, but it wasn't light enough. No, why? Just keep going. No. Oh, tiny little bounces. Tiny, tiny little bounces is what I want. Tiny little bounces. I feel like, should I have had like, maybe I should have had that one like, um, that one charm that lets me heal over time here. Maybe, maybe that would have been helpful. I think that was the high blood one. No, uh, this is where a long mirror mark of pride can really feck you over. Yeah, because I'd bounce and I'd go like, woo, all the way up. Don't want none of that. All right, hey there, saw blade. I'm not gonna let you take that. I only have a certain number of tries here. Oh no, oh, so close. That was pretty good, honestly. I'll take that. Oh my goodness. High blood is good, as is deep focus and grub song together. Oh, uh, well, hmm, nah, I feel that. Oh my god, I, my joystick was in the wrong direction. Here we go. Oh, if I only would have bounced at the right moment. I can see the heels over there. I can see another soul thingamabob. Hive blood is OP, but don't worry. <laughs> Guidini didn't have to use hive blood. And if they don't have to, I don't either. Because we are the kings. Or queens. We're monarchs. We're monarchs. We're monarchs in our own right. Dang it! I, I believe that I can make it over there without completely dying. I believe it. Oh my god, but not like that. Not with that level of belief. Belief and conviction. That's what it's all about. That's what it's all about. No. Oh, no. How could he do it? How could he fall this far? I don't know. I don't know how he could do it. How did he fall this far? Oh, he's dying. I, we're probably gonna find out what happens when I suffer because I'm suffering. Ah! Suffer. <laughs> All right. Our attempts are numbered, at least in this regard. Ooh, let's try it again. Careful, careful. Mm, I said careful. Nope, that's it. This is the last try we have. All right, well. Peace. Let's try it again. Ooh, luck? Luck on my side? No, it was not. That's it. All right. We got to go back, don't we? Yeah. That's all right. That's, that's all right. It's been an honor. It's been an absolute honor. All right, well, we're going to just, we're going to move on. That's the path of pain. That's a little, a little tidbit of what the path of pain could be like. I am curious to see how far I got. To be honest, but that was that was pretty good. That was fun. This place is painful. Oh, yeah. I think that's at least one way that you could describe it. Anyway, back to pain, but in a different way, it seems. That was pretty cool, though. Is there like a map for this area to know exactly where that was? No? All right. Well, I know it's here. I have it marked on my map, but it's a dream. So no shade. I don't lose my 10,000 Geo, which I've definitely been saving very much for, naturally. This is where the path of pain was, right? Yeah. That is so, that is so inconspicuous. Wow. I definitely, like, if I didn't just randomly whack that area and with the lovely help from the people in chat, I definitely would not have found that. If not for those strokes of luck. Nah, that didn't work. Nope. Our Geo is fine. We don't need to go back if we don't wanna. This, this is good. This is good. I definitely don't need to go back to the Path of Pain. Not this time. Not this time. I feel like that in and of itself could be a really, really awesome thing to try to, like, spend an episode on, but not this episode. Not yet, at least. I need to... Oh, I can just I can just hit those guys. I can just hit them. I don't need to do that. This was added by the Grimm's Troop DLC, not part of the base game. Well, was it really? Oh, wow. They added a lot of different fun things for this. That's awesome. I love the amount of challenge that it adds, honestly. Oh, I wanted to jump. But it did not work. It did not work the way that I wanted it to. Great. Great job. Oh, dear. Whoops. I said great, but I didn't mean it. Not like that, at least. Man. It's, I'm finding that there are more and more things that, like, the Grim Troop DLC added that I just absolutely love. I love this, like, these challenges that we have here. This is just, like, really, really fun. Alright. Can we make it work? No, we cannot make it work. I thought we could, but I was wrong. Gee whiz. 
And the fact that, like, the fact that we get to have this, like, as a part of just, like, we didn't have to pay extra for this. It's just a part of the base game is just wonderful. Oh, we did. Well, that's, that's fine. Just like how Weaver Song, Dream Shield, and Glowing Womb's rooms were sneakily added to existing areas. Oh! Like with unbreakable walls and stuff. Yeah. Sneaky. Very sneaky. I really like that. It's cool because playing the game so far after those DLCs came out, I was under the impression that this stuff was just here. There was just so many different, like, hidden things to find, should you so choose to find to go out and try to find them which was like awesome i just love i love video games that have a lot of content and this is one of those games that feels like it's got a lot of content i would try to cancel and it actually worked that was that was wonderful great job great unintentional cancel there pal oh a bench loveless oh my god thank you so much dear i was delivered quiche thanks lovely it says you're really really good I, I've been smelling this quiche for like the past hour or so. Slow baking. Slow baking? Oh my goodness. Here's the quiche. Oh. After the Path of Pain, this has been a wonderful, wonderful development. It's cheesy, garlicky, it's eggy. Oh man. Guidoni's saying, it's not really DLCs anymore. Yeah, because it's not like downloadable content because it's just a part of it it's just that this game got out as soon as possible because of kickstarter so they added a bit it's so cool and they do feel really really natural with the whole lore of the whole situation i apologize i'm gonna there's only a little bit left of this quiche i'm gonna enjoy this for a moment and the crust is so fluffy it's not even really a crust That was so good. It is so fluffy. I'm gonna die. This quiche was so fluffy. I think I actually did die a little bit. Wow. That was so good. Oh my god. I am so sorry. I had to have that moment. Wow. Oh, hi there. Hey there. Hey, what's going on? Bounce? We appreciate that. Great. Excellent. Oh my god. Whoa. I just got really woozy for a moment there. Wow. There's something in that quiche, man. The DLCs also don't really add much in terms of the game's overall story outside of the Pantheon having two variations of one really hard to get ending. Oh. Interesting. I think I do recall somebody saying in previous streams that this game has alternate endings. Something, by, by the way, I did not realize before going into the game. Like, the fact that well, all the stuff that we're doing now kind of gives, like, the opportunity for multiple endings was not something that I knew about. And, like, now that I think about it, I'm like, wow, this makes the game even better. Yet another thing, yet another way that you can experience this game in multiple different regards. And it's just awesome. Ooh, White Palace? You think it's the White Palace, but it's actually the Blanco Kingdom. So, close. Close. Very, very close there, Angel. But welcome. Welcome to the Blanco Palace. Blanco, did I say palace? No, no, I said kingdom, actually. We tried the Path of Pain. Um, it was painful. Uh, and so we, we moved on. I got pretty damn far. Actually, I don't know. I don't know how far I actually got, but I feel like I made a lot of progress, and it's really all about how we're feeling. Can I not dash through those buzz saws? I could dash through the buzz saws. Oh, great. Nice. Excellent. Oh, that didn't work at all. Which direction am I supposed to be going? Who knows anymore? Oh, darn it. We did it again. Gosh. But yeah, in terms of that comment about the music being wonderful, it's great. I, I love, I love Hollow Knight music. Christopher Larkin does an absolutely wonderful job of just creating this beautiful ambiance that just, it fits. I feel like the entire soundtrack of Hollow Knight is, it's like regal. It's regal and it's orchestral and it's just, oh, it hits in all the right ways. Oh, hi there. Oh my God, hi. Hey, I'm gonna sit here for a moment. Great job. Great job. What's up there? I see more spikes. That's great. 
Oh, I see a little bit of got a little bit of frames there. Oh, hello you. Beautiful hollow nest in the seal in the background. That's great. Literally this song is the regal theme. I mean in the sense that we are in the White Palace. You're right. You're right. We're all kings and queens here. We're all royalty. Now, do I gain anything over there? Maybe. It's possible. Oh, that looks pretty. I like the looks of that. But maybe I want to see what's over this way. Is there something to explore? Something? Nope, that's a lot of spikes. I can't get up there yet. Because I can't jump on those spikes. Let's try to go this way. It seems like a good idea. Maybe not the best good idea, but a good idea nonetheless. Hello? Oh. Hmm. Feels suspicious. Let's do it. Nice. That actually doesn't seem that bad. Oh, hello. Oh, hi there. Okay, a new challenge. They, they, they do that. That's pretty cool. Oh my goodness, no. No, I did not mean to do that. Okay, well, I was hoping to time that correctly. I did not. It's okay. Always room for improvement. No, oh my god. Why didn't I just move? I should have just moved. Oh, dears. Try it again. Let's try it again. We'll try this again. Oh, that was great. That was that was so good. Wow, absolutely perfect. Couldn't have done it better myself. Um, where to next? I am just gonna... Oh, man, it totally stabbed me there. Didn't like that either. Anything that happened down there? No, not really. Oh my goodness! Oh, I didn't see the spikes there! Oh my god! It's fine. It's alright. It's okay. We live and we learn. There is no place to gain... Oh, there's no place to gain soul. Well, that's unfortunate. No! Oh, I didn't jump fast enough. I also... I, I, ugh. That was a mistake. Totally my mistake. Okay. Carefully. Excellent. Excellent land. Oh, ho, 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 ho. You landed on yet another platform. Nice job. It was exactly what we expected you to do. But we're going to celebrate it anyway. Because it feels worth celebrating. I cannot get up there. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Yes, I can. Get up there. Hi there, everybody. I'm up here now. What do y'all have to say for that? Unimpressed. Yeah, no, nah, I, I feel that. Can I, can I go up here? Oh, hey, you. Hey, you. Hey, y'all. Um, there's a switch to press somewhere. Probably. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Well, we'll try it over here. We'll try to go up here. See if I can thread the needle. Great. The needle. Great. Excellent. We're doing a lot of sewing in here. Threading this needle so much. Oh, my God. I have to time this. No. I did not time it perfectly. Oh, my God. No, I didn't want to do that. Oh, but we're here, so it's fine. Okay, great, great. I need to time this perfectly. Ah, uh, it didn't seem very perfect. We're gonna try. No, no, oh, ooh. All right. Probably should have expected that to happen right as I got there, but I'm glad that it, I, yeah, yeah, that was good, that was good. All right, what next? I need to bounce, don't I? Mm, looks like I gotta bounce. No, I don't think we gotta bounce. Down, up. Oh my God, nope. It's fine. I tried. Or maybe I can just, like... Maybe there's a better way to do this. Yeah, that there felt like a better way to do that. Yeah, that, that was definitely... There were many ways to go about doing that, and I'm glad that I was able to do that. Pogo. Pogo left. Pogo left. Pogo. Pogo, pogo, pogo. Alright, when you're down, I'm gonna dash across. Oh! Excelente! Great. Okay, now we're here. Dun, dun. Dun, dun. Dun, dun. I'm studying the pattern so that I can get it on my first try. Dun, dun. Dun, dun. Dun, dun. Whoop, nope. <laughs> nope. I feel like I can just dash through this. I'm gonna try it. Oh, no, no. Okay, you don't do that. Oh, wait. I see little... I see openings in the center. Oh, my God. I should have dashed, right? I should have dashed. Oh, I can't dash in. Okay, so apparently I can't dash into that. That's great. That's really cool. I did not know that. Heads up, these suck. 
I appreciate the heads up. I don't, honestly, not sure if I would have gotten that. I'm kidding. That was sarcasm. I, I owe you all more than sarcasm. I saw that. But that was a good, that was good. A very astute observation. But how do? Ah, okay. I just gotta dash through it. That, that's what I gotta do. I gotta dash through it. Oh, ooh, okay. That was great. That was excellent. Oh, there's multiple. That was great. That was also wonderful. That was great. I really want to just, just do this. I'm so glad that I did that. Wow. Oh, what is this? Okay. That's it? I just have to fall down? We forgot to change charms for platforming. Timing-based parkour is not fun. Not when the spikes are killing you and you're close to dying. Oh, no! I didn't know! I didn't know! I thought I could hang on the walls. I was wrong. Okay. Oh, that was great. Okay, I need to go all the way down there. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, I have... Oh, not good. Not good at all. Okay, that was great. Played on your instinct. Oh, my God. No, I thought I timed it okay. Oh, that was so close. Oh, it's okay. We've got this beautiful bench to sit on. How can, how can anyone complain? And the music's back. Oh, no. Oh, that one played around with me. I did not like that. Wow. Wowza, wowza. Ah, that was that was infuriating. My goodness. Oh, change charms. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I can do that. I forgot I can do that. That is a wonderful idea. I'm so glad that we have people here who care for my sanity. Whether or not you're suggesting it because of that reason is... is I, I don't care. I know you're doing it for my sanity. And for that, I thank you all. We don't need... I'm not trying to move around. There's not much money to gain here. So that's what we'll do. We'll do that. I like high flip. Grub and deep focus. Got that grub? Give me that deep focus. I don't need the shell here. Where'd that focus at? Focus. Focus. Deep focus. I don't know which one's deep. Hey, deep focus. All right. Oh, I see. Okay, well, I don't want... I don't need that. I don't need that. We don't need that. Deep focus. Naturally formed within a crystal. The bear will focus so at a solar little rate, but the healing effect will double. Hmm. I love that. What else can we add on there just for funsies? Hmm? Agony. Maybe? The shroom? I like my little spore shroom. I like that. Unless... Nail mask? No. No, this is fine. This is lovely. Oh, that was so beautiful. That was great. What an excellent suggestion. Thank you all. Oh, jeez. Well, it happens. <laughs> I love the little... <laughs> I'm a big fan of the melting face emoji, and Hive Blood is literally that. It's like the melting face emoji, but it's Hollow Knight, and I love it. Whoa, that was close. Close enough. Close enough for nothing, actually. There we go. Whoop! Oh, no. Goodness gracious. All three together can be overkill, but if High Blood's waiting drives you batty, that's what the others are for. I mean, I guess it's not too bad. I can wait around for a little bit. Yo, literally, Angel, that emoji is one of my favorite emojis of all time. It's just like, I don't exactly know what emotion it's supposed to portray, but it's an emotion that I feel like I feel at least once a day. I guess, like, I don't know if it's necessarily supposed to be portraying a sense of dread. Maybe it's a sense of, like, disappointment. I don't really know. <laughs> it only one does one mask at a time. Oh! Well, that's fine then, I guess. That's fine. It's okay. I think I can survive for a little longer. Great. That was excellently done. Abs absolutely done. Great job, everybody. No! Ah! Well, great, great, great. Oh, so I have to wait for the one in order for... Ah, I see. I guess it's the embodiment of the This Is Fine meme. It really is. You know, speaking of the This Is Fine meme, I have a... I, I only own one Punko Pop figure, and it was given to me by my boss during a very stressful period of my employment, and um, it's that one. It's the This Is Fine dog. And I know when I received it, I was like... I don't exactly know what you're trying to tell me here, but it embodies a feeling that I am absolutely feeling eh, multiple times in a week at this point. And like, it was a very, very kind gift. 
And depending on how the week has gone, I place it in various positions on my desk. I don't think anybody's actually caught on yet, but if it's upside down, probably because everything's okay, actually. If it's right side up... Mm. So you can heal your last mask myself. Oh, I see. I see. Good, I good idea. Good call. Good call. Oh, I don't remember what I wanted to do there. No, this is fine, actually. Finesse. Fin uh, finesse. Finesse. Got it. Finesse. Great. Excellent. Just, just move on through. Just keep on moving through. It's great. Finesse. Excellent. Oh my goodness, just like the first time. Hi, everybody. Nope. Okay, and then we're gonna do that thing where we... Yeah, that was so easy. Nope, not at all. Not... Not as easy as I thought it was gonna be. Hey there. Great. Excellent. Spectacular. Unfriggin' believable. Wow, this is, this is great. Nope, that was the wrong button. Excellent. Great. Whoa, whoa, slow your roll there, knight. Come on now. A little bit slower now. Come on. I probably could have healed that one with the power of the high blood. Don't know why I didn't. Just impatient is all. Just like that. See, impatience, knight. Learn patience. Excellent. Excellent. Oh, even more excellent. Let's do that thing where I did it the first time and it was a wonderful, a wonderful idea. Great. Great. Absolutely wonderful. And now we're at the exact same path as we were before, but now we're fully healed. This is great. This is great. See, it's all about knowing the patterns. Once you know the patterns, it's easy. Great. Awesome. That was absolutely spectacular. Hit the switch. Yeah. Bam! Hit the lever. Hit the road, Jack. Don't you come back no more. Hello, Jack. Jack. Thank you, Jack and Jack. Don't know why I did that. Just felt like murdering today. That just I've got pent-up aggression that I... Oh, you know. It's a thing. Um, oh, where do I go from here? Well, I'm inclined to think that I dash on over. Into the distance! Oh my god! I was right, but not as right as I thought I wanted to be. Great. That was, that was pretty good. All right, what's next? Oh! Oh, hi. Hey, that was cool. No, stop. Not as cool as I thought it would be. And and what am I... Uh... Uh? Uh? Uh... I'm confused. Uh... Do I have to just trust my instinct? Trusting my instinct. Nope. Was there something back the other direction? Maybe I go here, and then I go back the other direction. Gotta keep me on my toes. Nope, I don't think this was- Nope, I do not think- Oh, wait, 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 idea, idea. Uh, brain blast, brain blast, brain blast. Oh, I have a great idea. Oh, an absolutely evil idea. I had an idea, I have an idea. I have an idea. I have a wonderfully magical idea. I just need to go down far enough, and then zap back the other direction. Dash and then double jump. I like that. This is the dash you mean, of course, I, I assume. Dash. No! Oh! Oh, oh, oh. It was so close. Uh, ah! Do the dash, and then I can double jump. Great. Or dash, and then, oh, maybe the double jump was... It's okay. We're getting pretty close. <laughs> I love that. Teamwork does, in fact, make that dream work. It was great. I meant shadow dash, but both work. You know what? Two things can't not be true at the same time. That's the power of thinking together. Whoa, hi there. Wasn't, nope, wasn't a fan of that. That's great. Down. Great. Oh, I, I don't know. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't. Let's try this. Whoa, okay. So that was exactly what I needed to do, but I did not do that. All dashes are equal in this world. Shadow dash, crystal dash, dash dash, double dash. Mario Kart. Oh, no, 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 none of that, none of that. Don't, don't be doing stuff like that. Let's do it to the wall, to the window, 
to the to the sweat something about uh, dingoes eating my baby oh dear hi there nope that didn't work hmm but i feel like it did whoa hi there it's definitely on the right track there i'm on the right track baby i was born this way okay careful great great awesome Oh my god! Okay, I need to be on the wall for that. I see. I see that now. Lots of different ways to dash. So many different ways to dash. So many different ways to dash. Grand. Grand. Grand, grand, wonderful. Whoa, hi there. So if I get- if I dash up far enough... No! Oh, just, oh no, 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 no. Oh, no. No, no, Cameron. Contain yourself. Just... Patience. Patience. Patience, Jason. Jason Derulo. Oh, damn. I can't even, like... I can't even think of any songs by Jason Derulo right now. That's how focused I am on this. All I can think of is just that, that the moniker of, like, Jason Derulo. Oh, that wasn't timed properly. Let's try it again. Let's do it right this time. Great job. Very, very good work there. We applaud that. Woo! Oh, nice job. Oh, was that okay? Was it okay? It was okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Those dudes were there to stop me this time. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Actually kind of rhymed. Nice. All right. Do I dare go into this expecting nothing? Of course I do. Here we go. Expecting nothing. Oh, wow. That was actually the correct thing to think this time. Can I go this way? Nope. Let's go up. Let's go up. Great. Awesome. Um, there must be more. Do I crystal dash or do I bounce on the ceiling? I think I crystal dash. But not to- oh, no, no, no. I was definitely supposed to just crystal dash the whole way and trust the process. Alright. Well, this is why we check. Uh, looking for the moment where I'm supposed to release this. No, oh, okay. Just like there. Yeah, that was great. That was wonderful. Don't go any farther. Don't go any farther. I don't want you to. Great. Oh, maybe I should have. Alrighty then. Let's proceed further. Onward. Great. Awesome. Great. Oh, excellent. Hi there. Oh! Hey, you! You've fallen and you can't get up. Bet you need some life alert, don't you? Well, how about this? I'll raise you something a little bit more. I'm gonna look into your brain. You do not have a brain nor a soul. Okay, then. Well, I don't think life... I think you're beyond life alert now, my friend. I am sorry. Hit these walls. There must be something in the walls. Do you have a brain? No, of course not. You're like the scarecrow from the Wizard of Oz. You have no brain. Oh, which side should we go up? Left or right? Void alert. Void alert. Oh, void. Hey, void. Oh, hey. I'll take some of that. Void. I don't know what that means. However, I look forward to finding out. Hey there, elevator. Hi there. Hey. What a lovely palace. I can't believe that this just exists in the dreams of the fallen. Hey, you. Hey, you. Uh, okay. Okay. How about this? Uh, nope. Hey, though. How about this? Do any of you have brains? Gosh darn it. Speak to- Oh, hey. I am getting chills just looking at you. Are you still alive? No, you can't be alive. Hi. Hey. Um, yeah, that looks oddly familiar. Hmm. Go right. Go right. All the way for a secret. A secret? I want secrets. Poggers, here we go! Secret time. Uh, oh, broken wall. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Oh, oh, hey. Oh, hey, what is this? That looks... Alrighty, then. No blazing kin. Only one light shall shine against the dark. The worm becomes beacon. Minds expanded to yield, to devote, eternity in promise, and charge in progeny cursed. That was awesome. Do you have anything else to say? No, that is, that is it. Is there more? Progeny cursed, as in your children. Your children are cursed. Wow. Were your children the one who was cursed? Am I a cursed child of yours? Maybe. Um, hey, sir. Uh, there's only one thing that I can think of doing right now, and that's checking if you have a brain. No cost. Too great. 
Oh, all right. Oh, okay. No cost too great. Oh. Do you want to be released from those mortal chains? Oh. Oh. Yeah, oh, okay. I am sorry. Do you have anything else to say now? No. Can I still hit you? I cannot. Sit upon the throne. I would take this first. Oh, there it is. The King Soul. When I found the first half of this, I was like, oh boy, it's in pieces. What do I do? And I am so, so happy. Huge no. Oh, well. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, it took me away. No. Oh, I had to sit first. Oh, no. I thought that I could take my seat after claiming my soul. Oh, oh it's okay. It's okay. Soul of worm, soul of root, heart of void. Heart of void, avoiding the heart, no? Oh wow, well, I'm the king now, and now I can get an ending like that. That was the only pickup I told you. Ah, it was, ah, I'm glad for that. That was cool, nice. Well now, now that the king is ended, I know that there is somewhere else that I must be, and I need to go back to where it all started. You know what this means. It's party time. Well, it's always kind of party time. I don't know what this means. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm going to go embrace myself. I got to go back where it all began. That's where it has to go next. Technically, I could get the blessing now, but I'm not ready. Oh, no, no. Oh, no, no. We got to take things back. We got to take things way back. <laughs> Hi there. My name's Ghost. And I bet you're wondering how I found myself in this tricky situation. Well, it all started when I was born. Or rather, when I was... Created? Hmm. Yep, and this will lock ending A forever. Oh. I think that's a risk I'm willing to take. Who needs all the endings? I can just play the game all over again. Here we go. I won't regret it. No, no, no. There are no regrets here. I'm not the kind of person who regrets things like that. Except for that one time that... No, 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 no. No regrets. No regrets. Down, down, down we go. Hey, sibling. Say what's up. Where are you? Where are you? Oh, I heard a thing. Oh, Jesus Christ, that scared me. I forgot the siblings were still a thing. No thanks. No thanks, sibling, brother. Oh, I unlocked more about them. That's great. Nope, can't, not safe yet. Where are you? Where is that thing that I need? Where is that thing that I need? Was it over here? Oh, hi there, yeah. Oh yeah, you have to equip it. Oh, I need a bench. Oh, where's my bench at? There's no bench down here. Oh. Where was the last bench? If I die, I go back to the bench, right? Nah, I gotta, I gotta go up. Did you meet, did you do the lifeblood room? Oh, I did do the lifeblood room. That one was cool. I don't remember where, it was the lifeblood core. I think I got from that. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. I needed to equip the thing. I completely forgot to. Wow. All right, well, let's make our way back up. That's okay. That is okay. I think that's where I got the lifeblood core, I think, was in that lifeblood location. So yeah, I, I definitely did that room. Up we go. Up. No, maybe not. Oh, up in the other direction. Mm -hmm. That was kind of cool. That lifeblood room gave me um, Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild vibes, where like I was under the impression that like, so like in that one, you have to like drain your heart containers until you have enough. But in this case, you need to have enough to even get into the room, which was awesome. Oh, hey. Oh, dear. Oh, hey, we were just talking about this place. Hey, what's up, dude? Can I go in there again? Can I actually? Nah, I can't. It looks like I can't go back. Oh, but I don't have any lifeblood on me. D duh. Pfft. That's why I can't go in there. Great. Sounds right, though. Should have remembered if you can get the blessing since you needed all the charms. That's okay. I, I have I have bloops as well. I Whoa. Not saying that this is a blip. It could have been totally intentional, but I, I'm just saying I have blips sometimes. And I think I've been using the blip a little too much recently. I just consider all blips to be... For me, a blip is just a momentary lapse in memory, or a momentary lapse in judgment, or just momentary lapses on pretty much anything. Which, come to think of it, could be a serious medical problem. Nope, if you miss the arcane egg in there, it's lost forever. Just, just months, so it doesn't matter. I don't recall whether I got the arcane egg or not. Hmm. That's okay, it must just be lost forever, or I gained the monetary value from it, and we are happier since... Um, I think the bench is this way, right? <laughs> I can say hello to my buddy, the lost kid again. 
Although I really don't want to. All right, let's do this thing. Put them on. Holy charm symbolizing a union between higher beings. Higher be- Pfft. Don't you know that I'm the king? Oh wait, well I am the higher being now. The bearer will slowly absorb the limitless soul contained within. Opens the way to a birthplace. Love that. That sounds awesome. Let's take that off. Let's take that off. Let's let's just go all into it. And who else to join me for this adventure than Grimmery and the boys? And, and, and this thing. Sound of soul of worm, soul of root, and soul of abyss. Heart of void. That was it. Heart of void was the last one. If Lost Kin clawed his way out of the abyss like us, he didn't get very far. No, no, no. We got much, much farther. That's actually pretty cool. And now that I think about it, I remember a lot of those tall, like those big sign things saying, this is a message for like higher beings. The higher beings being apparently, the higher beings being uh, the, the worm, um, the root, higher beings. Great. That definitely didn't in like insist upon a particular um, mentality of superiority amongst the people of Hallowness, the, the different species of bugs and stuff. Yeah, yeah. Definitely did not contribute to the hierarchy. You know, a castle system of, oh, the worms are better and, and the roots are better than everybody else. Well, I'll have you know that whatever species of bug I am or emulate. Oh, whoa, 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 that was creepy. Penitatius, come out of there. No, Jabo, stop. No, Cornelius. All right, we got to go in after them. <laughs> my boys are jumping in, guns blazing. Oh my god, hi. Whoa. I mean, they are literal gods. Oh. Oh, hi there. Hey there. Hey, you're cool, right? You're cool. This whole part is, might I say, grim? <laughs> grim, you say? Like our pal Grim from the Grim Troop? I believe you. This is kind of, this is, there's a lot of dead, this is, this is all carcasses and stuff, is it not? It all seems like carcass eye. Carcass eye? Carcass on? Carcass on what? I don't know. Oh, jeez. That's the that's the other place. Uh, see, like with the with the um um the um <laughs> what do you call it? No fudge. It's fine. It's fine. I'm like, I I am I am the the boy now. I am not just any boy. I am the damn it. Is there a, is there an AZOA past this circus circus? Great, excellent, excellent. Very very good job there. Are there any? Is there any soul that I can collect from these dudes? I don't think there was. Oh hey. Oh, that's cool. What about this way? Hello? 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 Oh, that wall looks like it breaks. The wall does not break! I warn you, it does not. What could break, though? Perhaps this away. Whoa! Whoa! Okay, okay, that's fine. Hey, Cam, What's going on there, Vio? Welcome back. Fun fact, King Soul play plus Glowing Womb is all the bomb babies. I don't like the idea of that. Welcome back, Vio. Long time no see. I hope everything is going well for you. I'm sure times could be better. I've heard news today that for some reason we may be going into a recession here in the United States, but honestly, who cares about money when you can care about the souls of the damned and those who fell before us? That was interesting. What was that? Um, what is that sound? Oh, it's the void gate. I can go through that. I forgot about that. Nice. Wow, this is spooky at best. Hi there. Yep. Oh, are they? No. Hey, yo. I I'm gonna heal myself. This is scary. We're going through the same in Scotland. Oh, boy. The whole world is on fire. Monetary fire, currency fire, financial fire. Financial fire has a nice ring to it. Financial fire has got that whole alliteration thing going for it. Oh, hey, you. You look like a chain chomp. You look like, this thing kind of looks like the one, anybody ever play Sonic the Hedgehog? It's the color, Sonic colors, the frenzy thing. It's a mirror. It's like obsidian mirrors. It is I, the knight, the hollow. Oh, this is an interesting reflection thing happening here. Do I? Do I walk inside? Can I can I touch it? Can I touch it? Can I dream nail it? What am I thinking? Hey yo! Oh, okay, what was I thinking? No cost too great. Okay. Oh. What what cost? Oh my god. Oh, it's all the bodies. It's all the bodies. It's a bunch of, bunch of dead bodies. Oh, hey. Hey, what's that? Is it me? Oh, can I wiggle? Oh, I can wiggle. It's me. Here we go. It's me. It's me be, oh, I, wow. I did not like that animation. Nope, did not like that at all. I love this. It always gives chills. Uh-oh, what? Pfft. 
I dream now of myself. I did not like that at all. That was supremely creepy. What the hell was that? Whoa, okay, okay. No. Oh my god. Is this gonna be like my way crawling up? And like starting the game? Oh, what? No mind to think. Oh, this is absolutely what this is. This is what we forgot. Holy shit. Wow. This is my way up. And I'm completely, I, I might I say, I have all of my abilities. No will to break. I have no will. I am a knight who is hollow, right? That's that's what it is. Whoa. All of this, uh, this whole choir thing happening here. Yeah, that's, that's doing it for me. No voice to cry. Suffering. Oh my god! Considering we have the monarch ones here, I'm a little concerned. Yeah, I mean, I think we, they could have took a couple creative liberties here. Or maybe this is all in our mind. Pale King's full of shit. This guy doesn't know what he's talking about. Born of God and void. Oh my god! This is so cool and creepy and it's got... It's got everything, really. Man, that's Hollow Knight. Hollow Knight's got everything, man. You want a little rock and roll? We got it. You want a little bit of orchestral? We got it. You want a little bit of... Oh, hello. What is this? Hello, you. Is it I? Oh, hi. Oh. Oh, what is this? Hey. Hey, what's up? Come on, Dad. Brother? Are you my father? Oh, are you going away? Oh, okay. Oh, okay. All right. Down we go. Oh. You shall seal the blinding light that plagues their dreams. You are the vessel. You are the Hollow Knight. Oh! Oh, the chills! Oh! Achievement unlocked. Void. Big horns? That is the Hollow Knight. That's the Hollow Knight. Whoa! Holy shit! Can I dream nail myself again? I have no reflection anymore. It's official, y'all. I'm a vampire. Oh, hey! Oh, hey! Hey, hey! Whoa, 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 whoa! Grimmery, please. We're the reject. We heard Dad accept our sibling, but not us. Check the charm. It's dark now! I love it! An emptiness that was hidden within, now unconstrained unifies the void under the bearer's will. This charm is part of its bearer and cannot be unequipped. <laughs> what? I can't take it off. That's pretty dope. Now what? Oh my god. I'm gonna go get my blessing from Salubra. <laughs> That's the only thing I can do now. The only way to feel whole again. Okay, Grimmery. Guys, guys, seriously. You gotta have some more respect for y'all. Respect for our brothers and sisters alike. They're not even, they're not even attacking, guys. They're not even attacking. They respect us now. We've gained the respect. Always on. They don't hurt. But not that Grimmery. Dude, Grimmery doesn't give a shit. Grimmery is like my t my angsty teenage son who just won't shut up. He's like, are we there yet, Dad? Like, are we finally done with you, like, accepting your past and stuff? I'm tired of all this exposition. I want to get on with my life. Well, Grimmery, why don't you suck it up? I'm trying to make up for my past, like, I don't know, sins or something? I'm just trying to figure out who I once was. Wouldn't you want to do the same if you just detached from me one day? Have a heart, Grimmery. Come on, dude. Have some respect for your father. Oh, damn it. Don't do it. Don't you... Jombo? All you boys. I really... I, I, I get it. I get it. But, like, you do have to be this way. Do you have all the charms? Oh yeah, baby. Oh, we got all of them now. There's only one thing left. Well, technically there's two things left. No, actually there's three. There's only three things left that I'm here for, and that's Salubra, the Nightmare, and whatever the final boss is. I, I don't know who the final boss is, so. But I'm assuming it's in the Black Egg Temple. And then, and then the Black Egg Temple, which is honestly where I'm assuming the final boss is. However, I don't, that's just an assumption on my part. I had to unlock, like, the three keys, I had to kill the three dreamers, I had to do all this other stuff. It feels like a final boss area, if I've ever seen it. And that's all I've got left for this game, at least for this playthrough. Until we go back for God Home, or we go back for other things, it'll be wonderful. It'll be great. 
Salubra, no voice to cry, suffering. Oh god, when there's a room here dedicated to giving us the scream of all our siblings' pain, I'm about to get serious with Salubra. Oh yeah. Oh my god, I'm gonna have all the soul. I won't even be, can't even, can't even contain this soul. I just can't even contain this soul. Or at least I hope you can. Like, well, I mean, that's the thing. Do I want to contain the soul or do I want to unleash the soul for the rest of the world to experience? That's, that's really what it's all about. We're God and Void. We're not empty. We're not empty. No, we're very... Well, I mean, we've got the Void Heart now. What do you, Big Rock, have to say to me now? Our pure vessel has ascended. Beyond lies only the refuse and regret its creation. Oh. Oh! Okay, so either... Okay, has ascended. I did ascend. So maybe I'm the pure vessel. Beyond lies only the refu refusing regret of its creation. Well, honestly... I honestly, I, I don't think I'm very regretful for this beautiful vessel coming to life. I have no regrets. We got this beautiful game. What kind of regrets are we talking about? This is a beautiful vessel. I like this vessel. The purest of them all. All right, where do I got to go now? I got to go up. So let's find... Let's go to the palace grounds. Let's go up. We'll talk to Salubra. And uh, that's where I'm going to end it this evening. We're going to get... Well, actually, what we're going to do is we're going to get Salubra's blessing. We're going to sit on the bench upstairs in Dirt Mill. And then we're going to see what happens next week. And we know what's going to happen next week. Grim is going down. <laughs> I'm gonna beat his sorry ass. That's the plan, at least. We'll see, though. He locked us up after he chose Pure Vessel, the Hollow Knight, not us. Oh, well, I mean... Oh, wait, did I... Well, yeah, I guess... Because there was a statue to the Hollow Knight. So I'm definitely not the Hollow Knight, because I saw a statue to them. However, it remains to be seen whether or not I'm a Pure Vessel... Or did, I mean, they, okay, they referred to me as the... The king... Or no, no, the, the thing that the cutscene said Vessel, not Pure. So, depending on whether that's to be interpreted as a proper noun or not, I, I don't really know. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. Hold your horses. Hold your horses. No spoilers. No spoilers. We'll figure it out. Probably. That or I'll be too stupid to notice. <laughs> we, we saw we're not. No. Yo, what's up, Dom? Yo, we are not. I guess I'm not the purest one. I just want to believe that I am. I want to believe that I'm the pure one. All right, Salubi. Where you at, Salubi? Down to the side. Come along, Salubi. We're going on an adventure. Hey there. I don't like you. I still don't, I don't like any of you. I'm not dealing with it. I don't want to. Dom fixed his car today. That's awesome. You fixed it yourself? I don't think I could do that. Not unless it involves like you know like replacing re replacing a flat or like you know redoing the oil change after it sat for a year and it's finally running. That's pretty cool. Actually, technically, I did fix my car one time too. It also sat for about a year in uh, somebody's parking, uh, in somebody's um, driveway. Um, we managed to get it working again. I had to replace the battery, which was a, a, a total bitch to do. Um, but we did wind up doing that. Uh, only because the person whose driveway we had it in said, if you don't move that car out of the driveway, I'm going to sell it. And I was like, you can't sell it. It's my car. So watch yourself. Um, and so we fixed it. And then I sold it myself. So it was great. Fixing cars with your dad. Feels like a good experience, though. I like that. I have not done such things with my father. Not fixing a car, at least. I've done plenty of other things with my father, but not fix a car. I feel like if there was any parent of mine to fix a car with, it would probably be with my mother. She just, she's a very, like, I think if I had to pick one of my parents to be, like, the more, like, I guess, explorative, but, like, in that handy kind of way. What the hell was that? Don't do that to me. Not while I'm having a moment talking about my parents. Jeez. Come on now. I'd probably be my mother. My father's a lot more handy when it comes to, like, you know, like, workshop equipment and, like, power tools and stuff like that, naturally, as my father happens to be. But my mother, like, takes particular interest in things that are not necessarily within her realm of expertise, like a car. She never studied cars or automobiles or engineering or anything like that, but she loves to stay attentive to whenever, like, the auto mechanic fixes a car to see if we can learn something. The game was like, don't talk about your parents. I'll talk about my parents. I'm a vessel of my parents or something. Hey, what's up, girl? <laughs> My blessing. A special blessing from me to you. You found it. I would love it. Thank you. My dear, blessing for you with your excessive patronage and those startling good looks. You've more than earned it. Oh, dear. What is this? Okay, thank you. You're cute. Thanks for that. Receive Saluba's blessing. A boon dispelled by charm lover Salubra. That was blessed or followed by a beauty and love. And a 
big slobbery wet kiss from whatever orifice you would call that thing. I don't know if it's a mouth or otherwise. Mm, yes, I hope my blessing brings you everything you desire. Don't be a stranger, sweetum. Come back any time. I've been blessed. Beautiful. Do you have anything else? Goodness gracious, you've got it, but all my lovely charms. What a stunning, colorful collection you've amassed. <laughs> You're even more the attractive bug clad in all those wonderful, sparkling things. I may have nothing more to give, but you must come back and visit from time to time. Such a dashing figure frequenting my store. But the whole village is jealous. <laughs> <laughs> yes, indeed. Charm lover salubra. Come on back again for whatever you want. The best thing, don't let anyone tell you different. Zitza, Zitza, sits, sits on my butt. Change my charms out. Well, I can't take this dude out. I can't, what the? So, so Salubras exists beyond her body. Is that so? You are a god as well. Are you not Salubra? I've come to bless you with the power of the soul. Oh my goodness. Ma'am, your village is totally dead. I know. This is... I'm okay with this. This is great. I welcome the sounds of this. Thank you, Salubra. You have... You, this is this is wonderful. Thank you. And my, my soul is all up. I love it. I just noticed... Look at all my boys just sleeping there. This is such a cute sight. We're all just kind of resting. Jabo is probably dreaming of fried chicken. He's always been a fan. Cornelius, I know, is probably dreaming of that, that little... That spiderette who we saw over in Deep Nest, probably. Very wonderful. Um, Jombo, I think you were the last one. Cornelius, Jombo, and Penetatius. No, it's Penetatius. Penetatius is probably dreaming about nothing at all. He's not the most creative type. And Grimory is probably plotting the destruction of the world and actually not sleeping at all. The Hollow Knight, though, or rather the Vessel, is um, questioning their choices up until this point. I'm okay with that. There are mods to turn the sound off. Now, why would you want to do that? This just feels a part of the experience. The fact that, the, actually, come to think of it, the fact that there are mods is something that I really did not take into consideration until this very point here. I wonder what kind of mods are out there. I bet they're cool. I wonder if that, I, I, I'm honestly curious. I mean, I really, really like this game, so the idea that I might play it modded, totally, that, it's not totally foreign to me. I feel like I could. And I used to do, I remember once upon a time, I used to do these workshop workshop wednesdays oh i guess my cocktail streams are on wednesdays now so that's not really we don't do workshop wednesdays anymore but there must be things out there worth the, worth to the explore if anybody has any i mean i guess i'll open up it up to the floor if anybody has any particular mods that seem rather interesting for this game i'm gonna write them down i'll write them down and we'll maybe explore them at some point i make no guarantees because i'm a very very spontaneous individual as can be clearly seen obviously um but i'll promise to give it my best shot I can hear I can hear a rancid egg in here, and I I don't know where you are. I don't know where you are. Pop, pop the bubble. Nope. Modern game can be wild. Basics can change the vessel to look however you want to. Others can let you put on all the charms at once or COD mode. Randomizers are popular. Ooh, randomizer sounds cool actually. I like that idea. I feel like I've definitely seen. I think in my in my like uh, YouTube feed or whatever, I've seen like Hollow Knight randomizers pop up. That sounds pretty cool actually. I feel like. Yeah, that sounds pretty cool. I'm into that. All right, I, I did not go the correct direction. I want to go. I'm gonna go back up. Oh, uh, up this way, this way, this way. Hello there, you ugly, ugly aspid. You don't like you at all. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make my way back up to. Did I go the right way? No, I need to go up. I'm gonna make my way back up to Dirt Mouth. I'm gonna sit my sit my boot on the bench and uh, prepare myself uh, for what happens next. Uh, I can't go this way. Did I get lost? Oh. Did I really get lost? That's incredible. Uh, oh, I need to go back the other direction. I see. Yeah, I got slightly lost. Yeah, and that's what we'll do. And then we'll save it till next. We'll, we'll fight the Nightmare King. Oh, hi. Oh, hi. There we go. Then the question becomes what you want. Randomized items, all of the enemies, location, the sky's the... Oh, that's, that's very... Oh, my goodness. I guess the like, maximum randomizer would be... I guess the charms um the abilities it could be um it could be the enemies the bosses and all that stuff i definitely i kind of want to see what the maximum randomization looks like to see how far we get with it that sounds awesome i know i've seen i've seen domstar play modded super mario sunshine where there's like a chaos mode to it 
And that's like, that was super awesome to watch. And I absolutely love those when he does them. Um, but like, I would say too that like, if there was some sort of like chaos mode for Hollow Knight, like that feels like something totally worth exploring. Cause that sounds amazing. <laughs> I mean, amazing in the most like frightful way possible, but like still kind of amazing in the sense that it can be done and you know, and people want it to happen. Oh my goodness, hi. Hey, what's up? No, you're dead. No, no, walk, walk away. Walk away. Ah, hey, bud. Hey, bud. Nope, bye. Hey, bud. Bye. Ha, ha, ha. All of you guys. Nah, you don't need it. Oh, you did need it. Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Hold your horses there, pal. Some go as far as to take away all the attacks but Pogo at first, so you need to find left attack or right... <laughs> left attack or right mantis claw. Oh my god, that is so funny. Oh, you explode. I forgot about that. I literally just saw that and I had quickly forgotten. That's so funny. You actually have to find the attack. That's great. Oh, uh, here, take that. Whoa, hey there, hey there, hey there, hey there. Nope, nope, don't like it. Bam. Oh, hi. Oh, bam. Oh, bam a lamb. Whoa. Bam a lamb. I don't even know where I'm going anymore. I'm just trying to find my way back to dirt now, honestly. Uh, this is this is the right place to be, right? Yeah. Yeah, this is this is the right place to be. You know what? I'll, while I'm here, I'm gonna go check on my buddy, the gr the grub, uh, grub daddy, grub daddy. How you doing? Are you still? Have you still vored your children? Yep. You're so bouncy. <laughs> I had to come back and say hello. <laughs> oh goodness gracious! Just run. Just run. There we go. Just make your way back to dirt mouth. Heal yourself a little bit, because I know there's one of those, um, that thing, whatever it is. I know you're here. I know you're here, and I don't like it. Up! Up we go! Up to the sky! Alrighty then. Pachurora! Oh. Oh, yo! So, yo, bud! Hey, what's going on? You seem absolutely enthralled there. How you doing? Great prince, so dark, so troubled. He's so troubled. So, what is this helmet? This is not your helmet. That, you took that You took that from the Colosseum, dude. But that's not the only danger I had to overcome in my quest for glory. You've noticed this trophy, haven't you? A keepsake for my final triumphant battle, deep in the pit below us. N no, um, no, no, no. Yes, life and earth claimed another victim, and the crowd erupted into ecstatic cheering. Cheering that was both loud and utterly sincere. To what do I owe my long strip of triumphs and victories, you ask? As I said earlier, the key is my personal philosophy, the 57 precepts of Zot. <laughs> Particularly relevant here is the first precept. Always win your battles. As for the other 56 precepts, well... Are you, can I keep asking? <laughs> Precept 2. Never let them laugh at you. Oh my god. You slanderer of Bretum. No, Bretum's room now has a dream boss. Excuse me? Oh. I gotta check that out. He literally has 57 sayings. I feel like... I don't know. Do we do this? Do we do this? Do we do this? I feel like we do this. Fools laugh at everything, even at their superiors. But beware, laughter isn't harmless. Laughter spreads like a disease, and soon everyone is laughing at you. You need to strike at the source of this perverse merriment quickly to stop it from spreading. Precept three, always be rested. Fighting and adventuring take their toll on your body. When you rest, your body strengthens and repairs itself. The longer you rest, the stronger you become. Precept four, forget your past. The past is painful, and thinking about your past can only bring you misery. Think about something else instead, such as the future, or some food. CONSUMPTION! We need water to understand everything. I feel like this is a bottom corner type of thing so we can see what's going on here. Hydrate if you need to read all this. Here we go. Precept five, strength beats strength. If your opponent's strong, no matter. Simply overcome their strength with even more strength, and soon they'll be defeated with more strength. Did I mention strength? You should always have strength. Precept six, choose your own fate. Our elders teach that our fate is chosen before for us before we're even born. I disagree. Precept 7. Mourn not the dead. When we die, do things get better for us or worse? There's no way to tell, so we shouldn't bother mourning or celebrating for that matter. Don't celebrate or mourn. It's unhealthy. Precept 8. Travel alone. You can rely on nobody, and nobody will always be loyal. Therefore, nobody should be your constant companion. Nobody is a friend that I knew in high school. No body. Precept 9. Keep your home tidy. Your home is where you keep your most prized possession, yourself. Therefore, you should make an effort to keep it nice and clean. I, I try that, but my desk is an absolute mess. Consumption, here we go! 
Hydrate or dihydrate, they say. Precept number 10. Hydrate or dihydrate. Just kidding. Keep your weapon sharp. I make sure that my weapon, Life Ender, is kept well sharpened at all times. This makes it much easier to cut things, especially when I'm trying to make a nice casserole. Precept 11. Mothers will always betray you. What the fuck, dude? This precept explains itself. Precept 12. Keep your cloak dry. If your cloak gets wet, dry it as soon as you can. Wearing wet cloaks is unpleasant and can lead to illness. Have you ever heard of hypothermia? Oh, it's a killer. Even for bugs. Precept 13. Never be afraid. Fear can only hold you back. Facing your fears can be a tremendous effort. Therefore, you should just not be afraid in the first place. It's so easy. Life Ender can't cut shit. We proved this. This is my Life Ender. It is a mechanical pencil. Embrace the Life Ender. Oh, I need that hand to click the button. Precept 14. Respect your superiors. If someone is your superior in strength or intellect or both, you need to show them your respect. Don't ignore them or laugh at them. It's disrespectful. Precept 15. One fold, one blow. Get it? You should only use a single blow to defeat an enemy like this. Oof. Any more is a waste. Also, by counting your blows as you fight, you'll know how many foes you're defeating. That's like the penny trick for when you go out drinking. Precept 16. Don't hesitate. Once you've made the decision, carry it out. Don't look back. You'll achieve much more this way. Precept 17. Believe in your strength. Others may doubt you, but there is someone you can always trust. Yourself. Make sure you believe in your own strength, and you will never falter. Precept 18. Seek truth in the darkness. This precept also explains itself. I found myself in the darkness by looking at myself in a very obsidian mirror and smacking myself with a sword. Precept 19. If you try, succeed. If you're going to attempt something, make sure you achieve it. If you do not succeed, then you have actually failed. Avoid this at all costs. Precepts 20. Speak only the truth. When speaking to someone, it is courteous and also efficient to speak truthfully. Beware, though, that speaking truthfully may make your enemies. This is something you'll have to bear. Precept 21. Be aware of your surroundings. Don't just walk along staring at the ground. You need to look up every so often to make sure nothing takes you by surprise. Self-consumption. I needed it. Precept 22. Abandon the nest. As soon as I left, I left my... As soon as I could, I left my birthplace and made my way out here into the world. Do not linger in the nest. There is nothing for you there. Nothing but sadness and your parents who don't love you. Precept 23. Identify the foe's weak points. Every foe you encounter has a weak point, such as a crack in their shell or being asleep. You must constantly be alert and scrutinize your enemy to detect their weaknesses and not just the physical ones. Dare I say, if you've ever exploited an enemy's mental weaknesses, you feel like a king and they falter without even a single blow. Consumption. I'm pretty sure he's saying baklava, come to think of it. Precept 24. Always make a seething baklava. Strike the foe's weak points. Once you have identified your foe's weak points as per the previous precept, strike it. This will instantly destroy them. It's easy. Right when you say just the right thing to get them going, perhaps bring up past traumas and stuff, they fall. Papanada. Precept 25. Protect your own weak point. Be aware that your foe will try to identify your weak point, so you must protect it. The best protection? Never having a weak point in the first place. All those things that you thought, like reflecting on your parents who you apparently don't like because I am the mighty Zot, get rid of it. Forget about your parents. You don't need them. Precept 26. Don't trust your reflection. Smack it. Smack your reflection very hard. When peering at certain shining surfaces, you may see a copy of your own face. The face will mimic your movements and seem similar to your own but I don't think it can be trusted. Precept 27, eat as much as you can. When having a meal, eat as much as you possibly can. This gives you extra energy and means that you can eat less frequently. Precept 28, don't peer into darkness. If you peer into the darkness and can't see anything for too long, your mind will start to linger all over all old memories. Memories are to be avoided, as per precept number four. I must take a small repast to mark as complete all of these consumptions. We shall continue. Precept 29. Develop your sense of direction. It's easy to get lost when traveling through the winding, twisting caverns. Having a good sense of direction is like having a magical map inside of your head. Very useful. And if you are the main character of a video game called Hollow Knight, that map in your head is almost visual. Precept 30. Never accept a promise. Spurn the promises of others as they've always broken. Promises of love or betrothal are to be avoided, especially if you are a person who is engaged or uh, perhaps in a long-term relationship. Dump them. You do not need them. Consumption. 
Man, this would have been an excellent game to have a cocktail to. Precept 31. Disease lives inside of the dirt. Like that dung defender. You'll get sick if you spend too much time in filthy places. If you are staying in someone else's home, demand the highest level of cleanliness from your host. Walk into the dung defender's den and say, Dude, clean up your shit, bro. It's how the mighty Zelda will do it. Precept 32. Names have power. Names have power. And so to name something is to grant it power. I myself named my name. Life Ender. Do not steal the name I came up with. Invent your own. How about Deathbringer? Precept 33. Show the enemy no respect. They don't deserve it. Being gallant to, uh, gallant to your enemies is no virtue. If someone opposes you, they don't deserve respect or kindness or mercy. Precept 34. Don't eat immediately before sleeping. This can cause restlessness and indigestion. It's just common sense. Really, your parents should have taught you this. If you had respect for your parents or parents at all. Which I, the mighty Zote, do not. Precept 35. Up is up, down is down. If you fall over in the darkness, it can be easy to lose your bearing and forget which way is up. Keep this precept in mind. This whole concept of gravity bears not on the mighty Zote. Except when it does. All the time. Precept 36. Eggshells are brittle. Once again, this precept explains itself. Precept 37. Borrow, but do not lend. That might have been another consumption. I'm gonna go for another consumption. Epic. Precept 38. Beware the mysterious force. Mysterious force bears down on us from above, pushing us downward. If you spend too long in the air, the force will crush you against the ground and destroy you. Beware. At this point, I'd like to confirm that the mighty Zote does not believe in gravity. Or actually does believe in gravity, in this case. Precept 39. Eat quickly and drink slowly. Your body is a delicate thing, and you must fuel it with great deliberation. Food must go in as fast as possible, but fluids at a slower rate. Perhaps if you eat the food too fast, you will die. But if you drink too slow, you will also die. Precept 40. Obey no law but your own. Laws written by others may inconvenience you or be a burden. Let your own desires be the only law. Precept 41. Learn to detect lies. When others speak, they usually lie. Scrutinize and question them relentlessly until they reveal the, the deceit. Excuse me. I'd take a little break there, excuse me. <coughs> My sincerest apologies. <clears throat> Let us continue. Precept 42. Spend Geo when you have it. Some will cling to their Geo, even taking it into the dirt with them when they die. It is better to spend it when you can, so you can enjoy various things in life. Precept 43. Never forget. Forgive. Whoa. If someone from asks forgiveness of you, for instance, a brother of yours, always deny it. That brother, or whoever it is, doesn't deserve such a thing. Precept 44. You cannot breathe water. Water is refreshing, but if you try to breathe it, you are in for a nasty shock. It will fill your lungs or the, the air holes that a lot of bugs have as their respiratory systems, and you will die. Or drown. Or both. Precept 45. One thing is not another. This one should be obvious, but I've had others try to argue that one thing, which is clearly what it is and not something else. It is actually some other thing, which it isn't. Stay on your guard. The missile knows what it is. Because it knows where it isn't. By calculating this difference, the missile knows. The missile knows where it's going. Precept 46. The world is smaller than you think. When young, you tend to think that the world is large, vast, huge, gigantic. It's only natural. Unfortunately, it's actually quite a lot smaller than that. I can say this, now having traveled everywhere in the land. <coughs> Precept 47. Make your own weapon. Only you know exactly what is needed in your weapon. I myself fashioned Life Ender from Shellwood at a young age. It has never failed me, nor I it. Precept 48. Be careful with fire. Fire is a type of hot spirit that dances about recklessly. It can warm you and provide light, but it will also singe your shell if it gets too close. Precept 49. Statues are meaningless. Do not honor them. No one has ever made a statue of you or I, so why should we pay them any attention? Precept 50. Don't linger on mysteries. Some things in this world appeal to us as puzzles or enigmas. If the meaning behind something is not immediately evident, though, don't waste any time thinking about it. Just move on. 
Precept 51, nothing is harmless. Give it the chance. Everything in this world will hurt you. Friends, foes, monsters, in uneven pasts. Be suspicious of them all. Precept 52, beware the jealousy of fathers. Fathers believe that because they created us, we must serve them and never exceed their capabilities. If you wish to forge your own path, you must vanquish your father or simply abandon him. Precept 53, do not steal the desires of others. Every creature keeps their desires locked up inside of themselves. If you catch a glimpse of another's desires, resist the urge to claim them as your own. It will not lead you to happiness. That was a profound one. I, I, I vibe with that one. Precept 54, if you lock something away, keep the key. Nothing should be locked away forever, so hold on to your keys. You will eventually return and unlock everything you hid away. That's a metaphor for my feelings. The, the uh, resent that I hold against my mother and father. Precept 55, bow to no one. There are those in this world who would impose their own will on others. They claim ownership over your food, your land, your body, and even your thoughts. They have done nothing to earn these things. Never bow to them and make sure to disobey their commands. Precept 56, do not dream. Dreams are dangerous things. Strange ideas, not your own, can worm their way into your mind. But if you can resist those ideas, sickness will wreck your body. Best not to dream at all, like me. Lest somebody were to enter your mind and rip those dreams from you. Precept 57, obey, obey all precepts. Most importantly, when you commit all of these precepts to memory and obey them all unfailingly, including this one. Hmm. Have you truly listened to everything I've said? Let's start it again and repeat the 57 precepts of Zot. And, and how do you feel about this, Breda? Completely, completely unfeigned. We're free! We are free! Who is this? Inspect. The great prince, heavy, heaving heavy breaths, flush from the exertion from the of battle. The figure emerged from the well. Triumph was his, and trophy he bore to prove it. The fearsome skull of his vanquished opponent. Starting warning he brought to the village, one that rung so true. Their white savior, thought a hero by the bogs, was a vicious beast. And the shrouded great prince was in truth the hero that we deserved. With honor and humility, he recounted his quest below. His epic journey of one purpose, to find her, protect her, his gray maiden, his partner in darkness. That is not what that story was. Descend? <clears throat> oh my god. All right, all right. I remember precept number 37. And precept number 37 said, we don't honor statues. We don't. So I will not honor this statue this time. I'm gonna go sit on a bench <clears throat> and try to feel good for us. She replaced us, but worse. I, I, she had to replace it with Zote, of all people. Why, Zote? Why? No, 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 no. We're not going back there again. How do you feel about this, Gramps? Faring well in your adventures below. I had an adventure of my own while you were gone. I don't usually visit the town's graveyard, but I thought I'd go and visit the grave of an old friend. As I was walking amongst the tombstones, I noticed a very strange kind of chanting coming from somewhere nearby. Extremely sinister chanting. I looked around to find the source and saw two bright, horrible, huge eyes staring at me from the door of a dark cave. I pretended I hadn't heard the voice or seen the eyes and scurry back to town. My friend will have to wait a little longer for her visit. There's a big beast in the graveyard? Wow. He's us who can talk, but sucks. Yeah, so Jeez. To reach Dirtmouth, most travelers take circuitous routes around the cliffs beside us. It's a hard trek, but now, but in the kingdom's prime, things were far simpler. There's an old pass in the cliffs that once allowed easy access. The bridge up to it has long since crumbled away, and even without it, a huge door bars entry. I can't complain, mind you, it's meant. We've only ever had to accommodate a trickle of travelers, even during our business time. I wouldn't want hordes of bugs to descend on Dirtmouth. I like the quiet. Good for you, other bug. That's just GG. It's fine. GG's fine. I love that. There's a creature in the cave. It's it's the it's a good person. Oh, hi, Salubra. My map has been updated with all the things that I could possibly want. What did what did I get updated for actually? Where did I go actually? Oh, down on the abyss maybe? No, I don't know where the update to my map was actually. Huh. Well, cool then. Awesome. No, that's it. All right. So here's the plan. This was a wonderful, wonderful stream. We started it a little bit early, but that's totally fine. It's totally cool. My goodness, my voice is killing me. I actually might have thrown up a little bit in my mouth, and I think it is slowly but surely wearing away at my esophagus. In any case, that was fun. So we have all the charms now. We've got the blessing. We've got Zot touting his high horse explanations of who he thinks he is and spreading his precepts to the world. Um, 
rather uncalled for to be perfectly honest and my god we did the abyss we did the void heart thing i discovered where i came from finally and i have no parents which is which is sad and unfortunate but that's that's totally fine it's it's fine i think i can live with that in any case this is where we are going to end hollow knight for now i hope you will enjoy the sounds that you must endure after the camera goes off of salubra bouncing and going around as most Breda's house maybe sir Maybe we'll go back to Vreda's house at some point. It's possible. That's te technically a thing. It was good. Very, very lots of progress. Oh, we gotta work our body. It'll give us some scary feet. I'm gonna do some scary feet. You can't see, but I'm currently pounding on the floor below us. And I will continue to do this until the camera goes off. Thank you for that. So in any case, everybody, I hope, look forward to seeing you all again next week, where we're definitely gonna kill that Nightmare King. The, the big dude who thinks he's all that. He's not all that. We're so much better than that. We really are, though. In any case, to everybody, until next time, I wish you all a wonderful night. It's a little earlier than usual, but it is still rather dark out. It's been a very rainy one here, here on the U.S. West Coast, uh, East Coast, whoa. And uh, there's a hurricane happening, or maybe it already happened. If you're a part of that hurricane, my, my heart and cares go out to you. I hope you are doing okay. Find shelter. Stick with friends and family. That's what it's all about. Until Wednesday when we make a cocktail and until Monday when we come back to Hollow Knight again, I think. It is Monday, I'm pretty sure. One of these weeks I'm streaming on Tuesday. I don't remember which one that is. Update to the Discord. Peace out, everybody. Bye!